All right, hello, hello everyone. Thank you so much for joining me here today for another fantastic day of Red Dead Redemption 2. Chapter three starts today. I am super excited that we got to another chapter. Chapter two was pretty long and uh, we definitely had a little bit of drama. So I don't know if we're welcome back in Valentine. I guess we're gonna have to find out. Um, maybe maybe we will be after we, we paid our bounty. I guess? I don't know. We're gonna find out. I'm excited to play more of this today. I think we improved a lot yesterday. I actually figured out how to use Deadeye, and we didn't die as much. We still did die, but not as much. Um, and we, we had we had some funny moments. I, I posted one of the moments uh, yes, from yesterday on, on TikTok. I'll, I'll make sure I post on YouTube and stuff as well. So. Love it when I wear the hat. I'm like, I gotta wear the hat as much as possible. Because I don't have a cowboy hat still, so this is gonna work for now. Um, <laughs> hey Morpheus, good to see you. Just, if I if I tape this down, does it look more cowboy hat-ish? There we go, right? <laughs> so, to catch up to the storyline, where are we at? So we, we've caused a lot of trouble in Valentine. And we caused enough trouble, and we got noticed enough that we needed to move camp. So we're in a new camp spot. Our campsite seems cool so far. I haven't really checked it out at all because uh, we literally got to chapter three and then I saved and we hopped off last night. So I'm excited to see more of this and uh, see where this goes. So we've been making our way through the game pretty nicely, but we're not, we're not rushing through because I want to do the side missions. I want to hear all the dialogue that I can. You know, we want to go do our bounties and, and some fun stuff like that because I, I really enjoyed that stuff in the first game. So I have really been enjoying this one though. <laughs> all right. Well, without further ado, shall we hop on in? Um, here we go. Okay. So here's, oops. yes, we have to do our daily yes to the autosave. Um, okay, Deadeye ability has improved. Yes, we can manually tag targets in Deadeye. Yes, we do know that. Okay, so this is Arthur's new look. We've changed up our look. Um, oh, why, why is he wandering? I'm not pressing anything. Arthur's just walking. What? What's being pressed? What's? Why is this? Why is this turning me around? What's going on here? Hang on. Hang on. What's happening? Yes, it is a Switch Pro controller. Also, I had a revelation last night. I was sitting there, I was like, what's the deal? Why can't I figure out how to like slow pull the trigger? Like, you know, in certain things, in, like when we're in like a duel, it's cause the Switch Pro controller, you can't, it's not like an Xbox controller. You can't like slowly pull back the trigger. That doesn't exist. It's a button. It's not like a, you can't pull it. And I was like, that's why I was so confused. Anyways, I had that revelation. I was like, oh my gosh, that's why I was having a hard time. And that's what, so, so that might actually be an issue for this playthrough. So we'll see if that actually turns into an issue or not. Um, okay, let's try again. Let's try again. Okay. Is he gonna keep doing it? Okay, good. He stopped. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, it just had to be unplugged. All right, everything is good. Crisis is averted. You blame a cat. It was probably a cat. It was. It was probably. It was probably Dio. Just kidding. I love you, Dio. <laughs> oh my gosh. We'll, we'll see if Dio comes to join us soon. We gotta get an emote of him with a little cowboy hat. It'll be cute. That'll be fun. Okay. Anyways, so what's going on? Here's our fashionable new outfit. As I was saying. As I, before I was interrupted by my controller here. Um, I like it so far. We made this vest out of a perfect cougar pelt. It was like our first perfect pelt and very exciting stuff. So I hope that we can get some more of those. But also I don't really want to kill the animals, but also fashion. So like, we'll see. We'll see um, how it goes. <laughs> and what is more important at that moment. Okay, so what's going on here? We've got... Sadie's here. Mr. Pearson needs to speak with me and Dutch needs to speak with me. What do we think we should do first? I feel like we should go talk to Dutch first after we just moved over here and did this whole thing. I feel like we have more to talk to him about because he he made some interesting decisions than last chapter and just like in general. Seems like he has some very questionable decision making. He's very confident. 
in his decision making, but very questionable. Um, so yeah, let's see. How are you doing, Molly? Hello, Molly. Fine. Fed up of moving all the time. Yeah. yeah. Just the way it is. We've been moving a lot. Okay, now I have to get used to a new camp layout. I have to have to get there. <laughs> How you doing, Hello. friend? Fine. <coughs> it's funny. Us in and up down here. My daddy died in a field in Pennsylvania, fighting this lot. I ever tell you that? Many times. I see I'm boring you, Arthur. Worrying me. We lost men back there. We have lofty goals, Arthur. This guy. We're trying to reform society to a kind Arthur's like, people died. He's like, we have goals now, and missions. There's gonna be casualties. We're thieves. And Your we're sacrifices no are more. ones I'm willing we to make. Are dreamers <laughs> He's sounding like Lord Farquaad. He's <laughs> Dutch Lord Farquaad. We I hope not. Day. No, he's not that bad. Nice At least so far. I, I don't know. I don't know if he is that bad. Old Jose <laughs> says that there's a trick around here. I reckon it's full of fit. There's smell of vision for the cooking stream. Oh, we're working on the technology. Tell them to hurry it up. But uh, but I'm thinking lobster bisque for tomorrow. I was gonna do the cooking stream on Thursday, but if I'm doing lobster bisque, I'm going to the store tomorrow already. Hey. And I want to keep Old it fresh. Girl, come on down here. Why don't you show us this crick you've been pissing in? Some more uh, Red Dead on Thursday, you don't then. look too rosy, old friend. I thought this warmer weather would... My days are looking good a long over. <laughs> <laughs> Always dream crushing and bubble bursting, you. Come on, Jose. Let's go. Hello, broomstick. Right, Let me give gentlemen. you a quick brush. Let me show you how it's done. And a quick little bite to eat. There you go. Get your oat cakes. My accent sound more southerny. <laughs> oh gosh, I'm not great with accents, but we're in the west. <laughs> Why don't we just fish here? There's a whole lake of them. Because I need to get out for a bit. Me and the old guard. Before any of them back there, oh, there was us. All right, let's make sure that the uh, cinematic cam has my it back today. It feels good here. You did well finding that spot, Arthur. More Charles. Oh yeah, and we me. saved the family. It's like I can breathe again, thick and soupy as this air is. Thick and Might soupy. Might even do your whistling pipe some good, Jose. I was once in this country with Bessie. Ah, feels like a lifetime ago. It was a lifetime ago. But what a life we have lived. How well we have fought, especially both of you. I hope so. But now, when things are desperate, we have to stick with the plan. Make enough money, then find somewhere where nobody will find us. But where is that going to be? We're going to cause so much like trouble. Where? I got some yeah, ideas. Yeah, like where? You, but I need you with me, not against me. It's a valid question. Both of, you. of course. Doesn't mean anyone's Still, against you. We do need money. So keep a low profile, especially in the local town. Yes. After Valentine, yes. I want everyone on best behavior here. No trouble. But start turning over the soil and the Dutch rocks. has asked the, asked the gang to up. not use weapons Dutch, or cause trouble in roads. We've got to be discreet. Imagine what a slew of rich, simple Wonder if they'll get mad at us if we do. Down here. Oh, oh, oh. This is perfect for you, Hosea. You'll I'll try not to, but no promises. Like Nothing would give me greater pleasure, but no buts. Not today. We fish and we enjoy the day. Looks like law up ahead. Play it cool. Yep, super cool. Whoa. We're not robbing this train. Not this time. Maybe next time. Hello, gentlemen. 
Hello. Well, ah, look what the cat Oop. drug in. I see. Well, well, look who it is. Oh, can I participate? Oh. Let's see if we can't sort this out. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have spoke. How are you, boys? Fine. This is quite some country you have here. We like it well enough. Hoagie McIntosh, at your service. Hoagie McIntosh? This is my deputy, Archibald McGregor. It is good to meet you. You a Scott? Partly. The Who's best that? part. <laughs> of course. Now, tell me, sir, what did the silly, fancy fop back there do? Nothing too terrible, I trust. He was accused of running a gold mining investment scam. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm sure he wasn't. He is a magician. I know him. He's a fool. What are we doing? But he is not a bad fellow. Now, can we... Can we just... Uh... I wouldn't do that if I were you. I... Shit! I... The Anderson <laughs> boys! I can't what? have more scandal! What? Well, allow us to help, my friend. Oh. Arthur... Chase wanted man uh, and and take Archibald with you. Just what I signed up for. Oh, we're Come gonna on, go get him. Okay. Guy. Perhaps we can discuss the foolish magician. Stay with that train. Don't let them get away. Keep your guns. All up, right, sir. broomstick. We let's go. Boys alive. Come on, hurry. All right. Ooh, there's Come a horse lying over losing there. Them. Will you relax? We're not losing them. Faster. Come on. What's your name, sir? Arthur. Arthur Callahan. Faster, All Mr. Right. Callahan, please. My neck is on the line here. Faster, I'm trying. I it. I'm doing my best. So what do these fellas want? So, I need to lasso them? You sure I can't just shoot them? Why can't I lasso them? Did I not say that? Got to get closer, I guess. Will you stop that? Goddamn power hide behind that man. All right, let's speed up a little bit. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Leave, Leave him. Okay. All right. Train. Train is slowing down to go through the station. We didn't run him over, at least. Hey, uh -oh. settle down. See if you can get alongside the train. Okay. We're trying to speed up a little bit here. Carriage? Head for that. Get us as close as you can. Come on. Hey, stop that. Let's go, broomstick. You think you can jump on there? Me? Why me? me? Because you ride like my grandma. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Is he just trying to steal my horse? All right, we're running. Come on, Mr. Callahan, I'm relying on you. We're running, we're running. Run, Batter! Run faster! Go, Arthur, go! Come on. Stay on them. Okay, yeah, we're waiting for cutscene here. Oh. Get the hell away from me. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, we're fighting. Oh, oh, I'm hogtying him. Oh, there we go. Look at us go. Okay, that's one way. We're going, we're going, we're going. Excuse me, coming through. Go, go, go. I'm coming for you. Next. Nope, that didn't work. I'm gonna run ahead and stop the train. Come on, come on. Okay, how's this gonna go? Come here. We need to bother. It's gonna be a knife fight. Can't do that. Uh oh. Knock him out. Bam, bam, bam. Uh-oh. Come on. Oh, come on, get him. Get him. Get him. Go, Arthur, go. Try at least. I'm certainly trying. Alright. Yep. Well, I don't think he's dead. <laughs> I don't think so. Fight. Oh, just about. Just about. How do I get out of here? Pick him up. Oh, my hat. Oh, I did forget my hat. 
Bring him out here. Am I not supposed to use the lasso here? I don't know. I feel like I, I feel like the lasso is very practical. Is that him? I sincerely hope so. Old Anders Anderson. Great way to not kill someone, you know? Come on. A fine job. Well done. And a pat on the back for me for stopping the train. Yep, go you. There you go. You are a natural. Arthur can only waddle so fast. <laughs> All right, let's take him in. Follow me. What about the others? Oh, we'll round them up. You will? Anders okay, well, is the brains of the one of them's tied up on the top of the train. So. You're the boss. That was mighty impressive, sir. I have to admit. I'd hazard a guess you've served the law yourself at some point. Uh, well, something I wouldn't like exactly that. Say that. Are you familiar with the area here? No, not really. On your right here, these tobacco fields? This is part of Caliga Hall, big estate belonging to the Gray Quite family. Quite some fields. Looks bone dry. Yes, we are in dire need of some rain round here, let me tell you. The Greys have lived in Caliga Hall for generations. Fine people. My family's been working for them for years. Sheriff Gray's the one I know best, of course, but they own half the businesses in town. Which town? Rhodes, sir. You don't know it? Where we're headed right now. Ain't what it was before the war, but it has its charms. I'm sure you already know of the Braithwaites. Like I said, just got down here. Another big family in these parts. They have an estate west of here. So in oh. what parts? Where are we? We are in a bit of a new spot. So it's south of Emerald Ranch. So it's not too far of where we were beforehand, but it's a new area. And we have some exploring to do. Awful people. Truly awful. They've been fighting with the Greys for as long as I can remember. We got one of the wish list items. Thank you so much, Crane. I'm so excited to see what. Um, it, it normally sends me an email. I haven't figured out how to make it pop up on stream here. I, I need to figure that out soon. Um, thank you for reminding me. I totally forgot that that doesn't work. Thank you so much, though. Sounds like quite the place Let's you see. got here. On its way to Valentine. I'm in the state of where? Yeah, we're in like a we're, we're in a fictional state. Here. But then they also talk about real states. They talked about like Louisiana and stuff. It's a cool world. All right, well, we're gonna try not to cause trouble around here. We're gonna see how well that goes. I've been getting better. Our honor is higher than it was. We're also doing more chores around town and, or chores around the camp and saying hi to people around town. What's that horse doing? Just hanging out? Here we are, welcome to Rhodes. Up there on your left is the Rhodes Parlor House. Very reputable saloon owned by the Gray family. We also have a general store, gunsmith, post office, train station, of Dude, course. You do not get yourself run over. What more do you need? Oh, good. They're back. And that's your friend, right? Yep. Okay. We're going to stop just ahead on the right outside the sheriff's Another office. Another cute town. Can you grab Anders off your horse and carry him in for me? Let's grab him. Just bring Broomstick, him here. great job. Very yeah, strong fellas. horse. Mr. Gray! We got him. Very good. I told you Arthur would deliver. Man has a passion for justice. That's wonderful. So, uh, about my friend here? Your idiot friend is free to go. But no more trouble from you, partner. I promise you this was all just a big misunderstanding. However... I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. Yeah, I'll pretend to appreciate that. Mr. McIntosh, it has been a real pleasure. The mostly good citizens of Rhodes, we welcome you. Well, we're just honored to be here. And make your friend behave. We got enough trouble from some of the residents, old timers who've gone sadly to seed and lost their dignity. How terrible. Come along now. I will keep this fellow on the straight and narrow. Well, come back and see us sometime soon. Excuse me, gentlemen. Uh, Bo, hmm. these better be ugly rumors. Okay, so we've established ourselves as... Penelope Braithwaite? I can't thank as you helpful. enough. Where have you been? Around. And where That's are you good. Staying? Smart. I'm renting a caravan on the edge of town behind the church. It's horrible, but no one comes looking. 
The whole town is trapped in this interminable feud between the two families. His lot, Grays, and the Braithwaites. Interesting. Two old plantation houses and falling out of the rebel gold and marrying cousins or not marrying. Arthur, that's what Jose, you start poking around. See what you can find out about that. I have missed you, boys. I've heard about bounty. Well, there's been a price on my head for 13 years. It'll take a oh. month to find us down here, and it seems like we can have a little sport. Well, they're good bounties. Where you hear this? Some fellas I met at a camp near the state line said there was talk of it in bars in the north and west for 500 miles. There yeah, I don't know where we're supposed to go. Super agents or some such. Super agents. <laughs> I'd love to meet one. It's just talk. I'm sure it is, but I could not tell you. Stay out of trouble. I don't think that's just talk. <laughs> okay, so these two plantations. Oh my goodness, DBG, thank you so very much for the $15 towards the new PC. That means so much for the new PC. Thanks for streaming. Thanks so much for being here and being Start a great part of our community. It means so much. See what the story is there. Yeah, and seven, it's good to see you. Hello, DBG. How are you doing? Casually riding through body or town through with a body draped over on the back. I mean, it was a criminal. I was helping the law. Everything is fine. <laughs> Passed by it earlier with our friend Archibald. Good, Hosea. You see what you can find out about these Braithwaites. All right. Thank you, Arthur. Trying to catch Quite up. A fishing trip. There's still time. I'm up for Catch it. up, Arthur. How about you, Arthur? Fishing? Or have you had enough of the chase for one day? I'll go fishing. Let's sure, go. Sure, why not? We got honor for that? That's fun. Great. Hosea, why don't you lead us to that spot you were talking about? You guys, I'm so excited to get the new PC. I kind of like this Better place. quality content and okay. Let's more see content if we can avoid and any less more lag. excitement. I'm excited. So, thank you guys again, and just thank you all for being here tonight. Stay out of trouble, right? Yes, mm-hmm. Hey, so chocolate for the see. <laughs> okay. Oh, here's our horses. All right, gentlemen, follow me. We got some nice horses. I like Dutch's horse. So, there's a white horse I can go searching for, right? Am I able to go get that horse? So how far is this creek? It's a bit of a ride still, and it's not a creek. It's the same lake we oh. camped on, just a different pipe. It'll be worth it. I saw some big drum and sturgeon What's there. What's going on here? Should be rock bass, bluegills, perch, pickerel too. It's a good spot. Conflicting AI. <laughs> You're as good at catching fish as you are at catching criminals, Arthur. Delaney owes me for that. Trelawney owes everyone for something, but his information is good. Plus, we are now ingratiated with the local law. Yeah, Dutch I'd did that it strategically. I'd say worthwhile diversion all around. Mm. So, you're going back to see that Sheriff Greg? Yeah, I don't see why not. They don't know who we are down here. He didn't sing the sharpest attacks. Neither did that deputy. If he thinks we can be useful to him, he can certainly be useful to us. A little hiding in plain sight. I feel like we're always hiding in plain sight. Mm -hmm. But sometimes more smartly than others. So you admit that sometimes you're not that good at it, yeah? <laughs> Where is this spot, Hosea? Timbuktu? Not too much farther. Anyway, you two never told me properly about that business with Cornwall in Valentine. What happened there? Apart from scaring the living daylights out of Mr. Strauss. That was about the only upside. John and I didn't even have time to get paid for the sheep we rustled. It is safe to say Mr. Cornwall isn't a man to let bygones be bygones. Yeah, we didn't even get paid for the Ambush sheep after we negotiated. He came with a lot of guards and what seemed like just about every lawman in the county. We've had closer shaves, but not that many. And if Cornwall found us, the Pinkertons couldn't have been far behind. They found me when I was fishing with Jack, remember? Listen, it was good we moved when we did, but that mess is behind us now. Yes. 
Jack told me you were a good teacher when you took him fishing. Oh, I said he must have been confused with someone else. <laughs> what was that laugh? Very funny. I can find this is the Lake spot. Isabella. Down Ooh, to we'll the have to left there. Are there witches in this game? Hmm. Right here. Right now. Okay. Our horse is named Broomstick, but so far, no signs of other witches. Keeping an eye out. We'll see. Whoa. I saw some boats around last time. Be good to get to deeper water. We're gonna take a boat? That's fun. Yes, over there on the shore. All right, fishing trip. I'm sure nobody would mind if we borrowed one of these. Come on. I'm not. I'm not a big fisher. It has never been my specialty. I got myself stuck with so many hooks, like in my fingers and stuff, like so many times, like an excessive amount of times. I got fish hooks stuck in my hand, so I didn't really like fishing that much for like right. a long time. This looks like a fine vessel. Okay. Come on, Arthur. Let's get her in the water. Huh? Oh, oh. I got a good feeling about fishing here. It's supposed to be some incredible sturgeon. Oh. Okay, here we go. A sturgeon is a great fish in Animal Crossing. I know that. Let me roll. You boys are too old for real labor. They make a no sturgery joke. You're too dumb for anything else. <laughs> You're still too it's quick surgery. for me, old man. Enjoy picking on children. <laughs> now take us to the deeper water and pray for good luck and stupid fish. Oh, I'm doing this? What about stupid luck and good fish? That'll do too. Head okay, this is interesting. Tap A to row faster. This is a pretty nice mechanic. This works. Pretty. I think, I think the only good. game I've All really right. been in uh, good luck, gentlemen. with boats. Let's see, quick, quick. Really come here at dawn or um, would dusk. be Assassin's Creed That's Valhalla. When you catch the best fish. And this is done really nice. A lake lure. That'll give us a much better chance of hooking some. A lake lure. And big like a sturgeon. Strong with a good old worm. Oh, worms are good for tiddlers like bluegill and rock bass, but you'd have to be real lucky to catch a sturgeon with one. Learn it is, then. You heard the expert, Archer. Let's bait up. Keep the lure moving slowly on the water so it looks like a little just fish just slowly. asking to be eaten. Oh, we're going real realistic with the fishing. I got a bite. Got one. Damn it, I lost him. Got a nibble there, oh. Arthur. That's oh. on the hook, Arthur. Okay, now we reel. We reel. Faster! Oh, now we stop. And now we go again. Okay, we can You're do nibbling. this. Faster! Nope, stop, stop, stop. That feels like a bite. There we go. Okay. Shit. Got away. Oh, he lost his fish after all that. Come on. Oh, we're so close. Our fish is right there. What is that, a little salmon or something? Hey, what is that? Beauty. Trout? There you go. Well something. done, Arthur. What is that? It's a, a trout. Look at that. me. I know my fish. Well, told me he once saw a monster lake sturgeon near the mouth of the river, just southwest of Saint Denis. Fifty pounder, he reckoned. <laughs> I would like to see that. Ha! Got ya. Hey, Jose. You remember that time we sent Arthur right. out fishing? He came back with. Three beautiful bass. Ah, oh, this again. What? I don't think I do. Is that a snake oh, on the yeah. water? You do. Is that a water snake? He was maybe 20. 21. 
walked in all full of himself. We had a big feast. Toasted him all night. This was 15 Is years another ago. One? Oh, I remember now. <laughs> then, the next week, Arthur and I are at the market, and Fishmonger calls out, So how did you enjoy those bass? <laughs> Look, you can fish, or you can go drinking all day, rob someone, and buy some fish. <laughs> You've got to reel him in now, Arthur. I'm going. I used to go fishing with this feller back in the day. Wesley, his name was. Real miserable bastard, but he loved That's to ours. fish. We go out all the time. But one day we were river fishing when we see Come a on. funeral procession going over the bridge, and out of the blue, Wesley stands up, takes off his hat, bows his head. Then he sits down, picks his rod back up, and carries on. Doesn't say a word. So I'm a little surprised and say, Wesley. Okay, here we go. Oh nice my goodness! War Gamester, thank you so much for the hundred bits. Felt I had to. After all, I was married to her for thirty years. <laughs> oh, there he is. Oh, all right, we got a bass. Nice. That's We're getting nice there. Sure. Getting War Gamester, thanks so much for the support. How you doing today? Oh, We're going fishing. Fishing stream. One. Remember those big salmon I caught? I'm assuming we catch like one year? more fish. We had a banquet planned that night until they got quite some conversation. You never had control of that dog. Uh, Hercules! So good to Never see you! How are you? It's great to see you all. Welcome everyone. I'm Paige the Witch and we are here on our first ever Red Dead Redemption playthrough. How are you all? You guys are all familiar with Red Dead, right? Twerk, how are you? Great to see you. You guys, if you want some very fun... <laughs> <laughs> Very fun, amazing content. Go check out Twerkules 2016 stream here. How are you guys? <laughs> Welcome on in. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, you know, this is my first I ever playthrough of Red Dead 2. It's been a fun one. I also play out different RPG games, like we just finished Elden Ring, and I also love Skyrim and everything. And we're doing a cooking stream tomorrow, Red Dead Redemption themed. I think we're gonna make some t uh, some lobster bisque from scratch. Maybe, maybe with some moonshine too. I don't know. We'll see. So, <laughs> welcome everyone. How we doing? Was what was your? We've ever been. What were you doing on your stream today? Oh, here we go. Feels like the more we try to head west, the further east we end up. I don't know if I cast this one out far enough. spots picked out to lie low in New Austin after the ferry job. Oh yes, I did. I liked it there. Still open and wild the way it should be. Somehow right. the desert we're makes fishing. you feel closer to the sky. No We're fishing. We just started chapter three. Anytime soon. Nice, another trout. Out. You just finished your playthrough of The Witcher 3? <gasps> That's so exciting. You've been on it since December. It seems like a long one, right? I know this game's a long one too, but oh my gosh. Did you love it? I was just talking about The Witcher, what was that, last night? And saying that uh, that that's on my list of games to play soon. So I thought that they were like remastering that, but I heard that wrong. I guess they're just like updating for consoles or something. So we're gonna have to play that sooner rather than later. All over tall trees and great plains. You led drought? Yeah, we're gonna keep that. We back to Sean. Well, look at us now, huh? Okay, is that, is that a snake? Is Plans that a water snake? Change. That's just how life goes. And can I catch it? Are we Did done? I ever tell you my mother's no, I don't think we're done. Blackwater? Really? She is? Oh, Apparently what? Apparently so. I, uh, I only found out from an uncle of mine years later. Snake. Last I knew, she was still outside Philadelphia. Wonder if it could attack I us. I left home at 15 and didn't see her again. She and I didn't always see eye to oh. eye. Oh. I wasn't always a very obedient child. Oh, we got a fish. I can only imagine. Still, I loved her in my own way. How much time have you guys all put into fishing in this game? <laughs> Somehow, even from the grave. I feel like there are certain games you can just put an in infinite laugh. amount of time. Nice, you hooked him. I like Stardew fishing a lot. I know a lot of people don't like that, but I like Stardew fishing a lot. Okay, we're almost there. We've almost got our fish. Please don't leave. Well done. Nice. All right, I'm assuming that's gonna be all of our fishing, or are we here all day? Keeping I don't know. That one, eh? You're considering playing The Witcher 3 soon? Got a lot right now. Well, wait until you're ready. It will be there. 
But it's a beautiful game, stories, characters. The re-release will be out eventually. Yeah, we'll get there. I, d I don't know if it needs a re-release anyway. Are you just anyways, spectating so. now, Arthur? Oh, I... Okay, I guess we're not done. Excuse me. All right, you fished until it was like, well, is this over? <laughs> they asked me if I wanted to go fishing. I'm like, sure. What What's the best use for fish? Like, do you guys like to sell your fish? Or is it just like a provisioning situation? Hey, Tukowski, it's good to see you. You only went fishing online. Is it worth it in, on in online? We're gonna have to try online you soon. Biting, Arthur. You hooked him. Okay, let's go. We're reeling in. Almost there. Oh, and we stop. And keep going. These fish do not make nice it easy. Way done, Arthur. I'm getting good at this. Make sure you don't forget about that and let it rot in the bag. Do they rot? Sounds like they rot. Okay, I need to cook these soon then. Ah. <laughs> well, Twerk, what are you gonna play next now? Now that you're done with uh, with The Witcher. 170 hours into Red Dead 2, and you still have tons to do. Are you oh bored my goodness. Already, Arthur? I mean, yeah. I don't know. What? No, I didn't say that. I didn't say yes. I would never. <laughs> You can eat the fish, and there's a guy who collects fish pelts. Oh. So, can I Are sell him maybe to the trapper? To make your lure look like a dead fish? Gosh, call me out. Ain't moving. I wonder if I put my fishing rod away. If it... Arthur's got a bite. You said I have a bite, and then I pressed it, and I didn't have a bite. Dutch lied to me. We're gonna try that again. All right, one more fish here. That wasn't very far. Don't know if that was far enough. Don't think it was. Maybe it was. Oh, oh, why, why? I like how the water snake is just swimming around. It's just going for a nice little swim. Oh, you're gonna play Elden Ring. You got a bite there, <gasps> Have so much fun. Fish on the line, do you know what kind of uh, build you're gonna do? Oh, we did get a fish. Astrologer was great. Being a mage is underrated. There you go. That's nice. a nice one. That's a nice one. Yeah, that's a keeper. Okay, so I'm wondering if I just. Put this hey, away. Yes, we there we go. Today, Already? You ain't been chasing down outlaws. All right. Think we got a decent haul here. Pearson will be happy. Oop. Should we head back? We yes, we should. Boat. Not too far back to camp from here. I think Good we gotta idea. go talk to Pearson next, Could anyways. What about the horse? Well, they'll find their way back. Just follow the shore south, Arthur. That was fun. <laughs> Thank you, boys. Now, Hosea. Yes. How about a song? Okay. Um, all right. I got gonna sing us a song. I asked that gal to give me some. I asked that gal to give me some. She says, wait until the tailors is done. I couldn't wait till the tailors was done. Can't wait till the taters are done. I couldn't wait till the tears was done. Threw her on the floor and I knocked off some. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I wish to God I'd passed her by. Mm -hmm. I wish to God I'd passed her by. Taters got burned and so did I. The taters, <laughs> no. <laughs> that was, that was oh, pretty no. good. That was you pretty know, good. What song we should be singing? What? Hi, gotcha, welcome. No, that's well, not me. That sounds fun, though. Bring my dad on to play games. That sounds fun. Well, we need three poor mariners to leak up from the seas. We spend our lives in jeopardy while others live at ease. Shall we go dance the sun around 
Karaoke stream? Oh, you want me to sing along? I need to learn the lyrics. Your favorite sea shanty, yes. I don't know if I'm supposed to go back this way. I feel like we should maybe have gone back to our horse, but then we'd miss out on these beautiful songs. <laughs> what is that? How much did they have to drink while fishing? <laughs> Can't look like we had too much fun. That would be terrible. I mean, fair enough, though. I don't know if anyone else is having much fun, so. They do this in Assassin's Creed 4. Yeah, they sing in Assassin's Creed Valhalla. I remember that. That was fun. They had some good songs. You fish until All the beer right. is gone. Mm. I think I, well, I mean, we are going to be okay. I know. Well, I always know whenever I got you two by my side, things are going to be just fine. Nice. This place will be good for us. For now, anyway. I hope so. I hope so, too. Well, at least it's got a nice boat dock. That's kind of fun. Um, let's see. Twerk, you were saying you're gonna play something with a big weapon that hits hard, but not too slow. Fair enough. There's a lot of those good ones. There's so many good weapons in Elden Ring. It's, like, actually overwhelming the amount of weapons that I ended the game with, and I didn't even find them all. Um, and they're all, like, really cool. So, you know. Mmm... Magic interests you, but you like being in the business with the weapons. Fair enough. Also, both can be fun. <laughs> when the beer is gone, you stop fishing. True. Also true. Hello. You can make this place work? Of course. Don't I always? Sure. Who's, who's causing trouble? Hello. Hello. Don't be like that. Uh, just, a, just a few bucks, I'm sure. Chaotic Good Mage, thank you so much for gifting us up to twerk. It is fantastic to have you both here. Thank you so much, everyone, for just the support. Chaotic, I really hope you've been enjoying the streams, the content, the community. Twerk, thank you again for bringing your community over here. Thank you so much for the raid. And I wish you the best of luck with your Elden Ring escapades. If you guys are looking for another Elden Ring playthrough, twer Twerk's gonna have some good content. So, you're excited to explore and see it all. The map, you, you keep thinking that you've explored all of the map, and then you're wrong. That's all I'll say. <laughs> Get lost. I was so shocked when when I actually explored all of the map. I was I was beyond shocked. It took a while. <laughs> oh, I'll go try someone with a heart. You do that. Oh yeah, you gotta save beer for the fish batter. Ooh, fry it up. Okay, so we got some different things going on in camp now. So, Leopold Strauss. Oh, this is the money lending guy. I don't really want to do his quests. His quests suck. <laughs> not re well, not really, but like they're just sad. Like they're just like what We don't like him. Arthur doesn't like him. He even wrote in his journal how he doesn't like him. We can go fishing. No, we just went fishing. I don't need more fishing. I don't know if I want to do anything for him. As much as I want to do side quests, I don't think I want to do his side quest. I gotta go beat people for money that they were, like, tricked into blending. I, got, I don't know. Hmm. He is optional, so I think I'm going to opt not. Let's see, is this where we can contribute to camp? Yes, this is where we can contribute now. So, let's take a look at what we can contribute. Let's see, has a crazy storyline thing happened? Nope, not yet. Well, 
We started chapter three. Hey, Morgan. Welcome on in. How's it going today? Um, we started chapter three here, and some stuff went down at the end of chapter two. We're definitely building up for some more stuff, um, but it was definitely an exciting end of chapter two, and we're, we're at a new camp now. And let's, let's give some new items here. I'm just going to keep giving these things because I don't really want to sell them. And I might as well just give them to, to the camp, you know? I might as well. I'm just going to get one more. Sure. And another ring. All right, we got some honor for that. That's nice. Our honor, look at that. It's getting there. It's getting there. Hmm. Let's see. Red debt collection. <laughs> Um, let's take a look at our ledger real fast. Let's see. There's a speedrun record for Elden Ring in eight minutes. How? I'm gonna have to look that up. I don't even know how. How? how. <laughs> Takes like eight minutes to start the game, right? Like, oh my gosh. You're waiting for crazy stuff to go down, right? I, I guess we're gonna have to see if something crazy happens. Like, I have no idea. Okay, so we can get throwing knives, shotgun and rifle ammo, improve the t rest of tents in the camp. That improves the overall mood. Oh, we can get a camp boat. Easy transport and access to fishing holes. That sounds cool. I feel like we should get those leatherworking tools soon. Are those worth it? Do you recommend the Strauss quest? Uh-oh. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe. Oh, Maybe I should just do it? I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I gotta decide. Okay, I feel like improving the mood of camp could be really helpful. But... I don't know. I kind of want to know what, what tools he can get us. Yeah, Pearson can make extra gear. Sure, let's just... Let's get it. Why not? He can craft upgrades for my satchel. So does that mean that we can get extra crafting space, potentially? Hope so. Let's find out. We need to go talk to Pearson anyways. Yeah, the quest from Strauss made you feel yikes. Yeah, same. I didn't love them. Mm, is Pearson still gonna be open for business? I'm assuming we're just gonna go right into his quest. Oh, say whatever you damn well please, but I tell you, if I don't get out of here soon, I'm gonna kill somebody. And if uh, you don't stop hissing at me, I'm gonna kill you. They're pulling knives. You come near me, sailor, and I'll slice you up. You put that knife down, or you could be missing a hand. What is wrong with you two? Yeah, what's I going on? Chopping vegetables for a living. Oh, I'm sorry, man. Uh, okay. Was there insufficient feathers <laughs> in your pillow? I ain't lazy, Mr. Morgan. I'll work, but not this. Well, I ain't cooking work. <laughs> what kind of work are you wanting? My husband and I, we shared the work. All of it. I was out in the fields. I can hunt, carry a knife, or use a gun. But I tell you, you keep me here, I'll skin this fat old coot and serve him for dinner! Watch your damn mouth, you crazy goddamn fishwife! <laughs> no! Whoa. Both here! Oh. Well, come with me then. You wanna head out there? Run with the man? Oh, is she gonna come with? Be it. But we do more than just hunting. We're hunted. And them things hunting us, well, they got guns of their own. I ain't afraid of dying. Good. You need anything, Mr. Pearson? Maybe me and Mrs. Zad are gonna take a little ride. <gasps> Is she gonna come yeah. with? Oh, I'm excited. Sure. Here's my list, and can you post this letter for me while you're there? Sure. Come on, princess. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think they're friends. Are you coming with me then, woman? Yeah, sure, Tukowski. Vague recommendation for a great so side I'm quest. So I graduated sure. from chopping vegetables to shopping. Shut your goddamn mouth. Leatherworking tools. Pearson can make decorations for the camp and worth it to make satchels. Okay, cool. All right, Sadie. Let's go. Excited yeah. to... Learn more about her. We don't know much about her yet. I guess. I ain't no 
Gullion, and I sure as hell ain't taking orders from that sweet half-wit. I guess we all gotta do our share, Princess. Princess, uh oh. Where's that letter? Oh, are you reading his mail now? Oh, robbing and killing's okay, but letter reading's where we draw the line. Mm. There. <clears throat> Dear Aunt Kathy, you are some else. I haven't heard from you in I like her some voices. time, so I pray to the Lord above that your health has not deteriorated further. Blah blah blah. It's boring. Ooh. <laughs> Wait a sec. Listen to this. Since we last corresponded, I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. <laughs> Before you ask, I am still yet to take a wife, but I can assure you it's not for a lack of suitors. <laughs> uh -oh. He ever actually even talked to a woman he ain't paid for? Oh, oh look. We're all hiding behind something. <laughs> and what's this? Return to Tacitus Kilgore. Oh, there. Now that's Dutch's idea. All males be sent to the same age. Whenever we set up somewhere new, Strauss, he heads into town. Cousin to start expecting mail from a Tacitus Kilgore, whatever they changed it to. What a name. <laughs> Here, give me that back. We got work to do. We got work to do? All right. Slow down a little bit so I don't run anyone over. Not trying to run anyone over today. They asked me not to cause trouble. I'm going to try to hold up my end of that bargain. Okay, where do I stop? Is this where I stop? Okay. okay, here we go. Here we are. So, what's the plan? I shoot the shopkeeper while you. No, 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 not here. No, no, no. He was outlaws. Not here. Outlaws, not idiots. We rob fools that rob other people. These people are just trying to get by. So you head on in there and you buy some food. We <laughs> rob people that are trying to rob other no people. Guns. Fair enough. For sure. This time, there'll be time for killing soon enough. What are you doing? I'm gonna go check the mail. Go check Nothing the mail. Exciting. All right, let's check this place out. Study the horse. Is that a new kind of horse? Oop! 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 No! That Wait. is very peculiar behavior. I'm sorry. Hey, folks. Hello. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to go. Nice to be see weird. some friendly faces around here. Sorry. Good morning. Good day to you. Hey there, partner. Hello. What do you Sir, mean? good morning. What's the <coughs> Look, get some ointment, all right? Morning, mister. For a private matter. Now, I really must be going. Don't mention this to Vera. Morning. Okay, anyways, to the post office. See, this is a deep question, but would you consider this game to be possibly one of the best video games of all time? This one, Red Dead 2? I mean, I I don't know if I can make a fair judgment yet without having played through it all. Fine day to you. I'd say it's a contender. Yes. I'd say it's a possibility. Stay tuned for the rest of the answer. But yeah. <laughs> Nico, thank you so much for the raid and welcome on in. Thank you so much for bringing your community on over here. Welcome everyone. Paige the Witch here if you don't know me. We're on our first ever playthrough of Red Dead Redemption 2 and we just started chapter 3 today. So stuff is escalating and uh, and we're taking our new friend Sadie with us and we're, we're doing some mail checking at the moment. Exciting stuff. Can we get a huge shout out for Nico Aerith? Check out the stream, drop a follow. How are you and what were you up to today? Are you playing some some more Red Dead? Mm, right, you're making sure it had not been eliminated yet. No, no, War Games no, this has not been eliminated from from like top ten games or something. Or you know, one of the best games. It has not been eliminated. No. It is still in the running. Nico's a pro. Amazing. What were you guys up to? Tell me all about it. And welcome on in. Thank you so much for the follows. Welcome to the Witch's Lair. Morning, Great to have you all here with us. Can I help you, mister? All right. Yes, uh, I do I have like a bounty? Post a letter. I hope not. All right. We're going to find out. Uh, send mail. Here we go. 
I know how to do this stuff. <laughs> I've gotten better at this game. Day, day one through three, I was dying a lot. We're dying less now, but also I haven't done as much yet today, so there's plenty of time. Okay, letter from Pearson. Yep, there we go. Okay, no trouble. Thank you. Do we have a bounty? Bye now. Nope. Good for us. Hmm. Let's see you're well. You're playing The Witcher, but tomorrow you play Red Dead One. <gasps> Fun. Are you are you just starting it tomorrow? I'm very excited for you. I am both Omega Good Vibes and <laughs> Welcome Drog. Very kind words, Nico. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um and that's very kind, right? It's great I'm to have already. you all here. I'm working. What is taking you so long? Listen, lady, I got it all in the uh -oh. wagon there. I could train my goat to do this faster. <laughs> She's sassy. All right, Sadie, let's go. She's got some fun outfits. Looks like she got a new one. Thanks. Here, take that for yourself, okay? Well, how was The Witcher? You died a lot the first Thanks. time you played. I mean, fair enough. Well, give it back then. Jesus. I didn't ask for his goddamn help. Oh. Why don't you drive? Okay. Come on, lady, get a move on. <laughs> I like Sadie, not lady. I know. <laughs> yeah. I know. So, you get everything? I think so. And some new clothes, I see. Don't start. We just got to Mexico in the first playthrough, looking for Javier. Well How fun. Like I told you, Gosh, my I missed that game. and I shared all the work. I wasn't some little wife with a flower in her hair making cherry pies all day. Yeah, mm, cherry pie. <laughs> you sure look the part now. Won't be long before you're smoking cigars and playing the harmonica. What? <laughs> I'll have you know. I used to love playing He's like, I'm an expert before. harmonica player. Thank you very much. Well, my house and everything I own. When I had a harmonica. Oh, ground. no. I know. I'm real sorry about what you... Uh, you know... Maybe I'll keep my eye out for another one. What? I don't want no pity. Just treat me equal and no. Nobody's taking nothing from me ever again. All right, Sadie. Kick butt. Just don't kill the kill camp. The camp <laughs> Please. Oh my gosh. Can't wait to do your Sadie hey, cosplay. That sounds like hey. a great idea. Um. Okay. Wait. Before this happens. Hi, Effie. Good to see you. Um. Let's see. One of my favorite video games. Definitely, Skyrim is one of them. Um, I do love Animal Crossing a lot. Mm, I never streamed Animal Crossing, though. That's that's just... I played that by myself. Um, aside from that, I'm, like, trying to think of... Like, I really loved Elden Ring. Um, what else have I played a lot? I loved the first Red Dead. Why am I blanking? I've suddenly forgotten every single video game I've ever played. You gotta love that. Uh, <laughs> What, uh, I also really loved Mass Effect. What you folks up to? Just heading home. You're in the Morn Raider country. Keep it cool. You need to pay uh -oh. a toll to pass through here. No, I don't think so. Lemoyne, that was the You state. don't think so? How about you pull over right now? Pull over? That's what I said. Hey, how's about this? Oh, she... Go, go, go! Shit! Okay, so let's get our repeater. Okay, I'm trying to mark him. And then we're trying to mark him. Bam. Okay, we're getting better at this. What the hell was that? Yeah, what? I mean. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, who's that? Who's that? Who, what? What? She? What? Okay, I need to run. Yeah, what are you doing, Sadie? All right, let's do a little, little more dead eye. Oh, 
true. She's like, see, I can do it. I'm like, yes, I never doubted you. <laughs> Not even for a moment. Come on. Lady, you are enjoying this far too much. <laughs> oh, come on. Are they still over there? Oh yeah, there's there's one right there. Come on, come on. Oh come on, I'm so bad at this. There we go. Come on. Come on. I swear. You're gonna peek out and then I'm gonna dead eye. And then you're gonna move. Okay, we gotta go just get him. Bam. And Oh. No, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna shoot someone who's running away. I'm not gonna do that. That's kinda messed up. Okay, can I loot them? Doesn't look like I can loot them. We should get out of here. Doesn't look like it's letting me do that anyway, so let's go. No, pass those Ooh, uh, realism what? of this game is off the charts. You've True. Caused enough trouble already. I'm fine. Am I am I driving? Those bastards, huh? Remind me not to get on your bad yes. side. And they was clearly planning to bushwhack us. You did good. But that's a lot of mess to make near camp. True. Hope it don't bring anyone sniffing around. Are you gonna tell Dutch? Maybe. Dutch. If he asks. <laughs> but maybe not. Careful now. Well, we'll see. So who did they say they were? Lemoyne Raiders? Yeah, something. Oh my like gosh, that. I hate you here. <laughs> Sandy turns out to be John Wick, basically. Life. You hope the horses have plot armor? Anyway. Generally. We also have horse reviver if needed. Oh wait, what? Wait, did it just turn me around? Did I did I miss? My bad. Wait. Oh, I passed the camp. Oh my bad. I was just I was just going. I was on a mission. Oopsie. Oopsie. All right, let's try that again. We show those bastards, huh? Remind me not to Too get far. On your bad side. I didn't realize we were that close to camp. No wonder Arthur's like, come on. Oh gosh, okay. Okay. All right, we're under control. Hope it don't bring anyone sniffing around. Are you going to tell Dutch? Maybe. If he asks. I see. I'm supposed to turn. I see. So who do they say they were? Lemoyne Raiders? Yeah, something like that. Who knows? <laughs> anyway. I like how it just fails me. Don't you go ribbon piercing about that letter. How dare you? I wouldn't dream of it. Right, you wouldn't. I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. <laughs> I won't be giving you no mail to post <laughs> anytime soon, that's for sure. <laughs> I just want to peek in that journal of yours. The oh, yeah, we got to read more of the journal. Not a chance. Oh, why are we going so wild? We're zigzagging. No, we did Not good. <laughs> well, Enough. I'd like to say I missed your refined conversations, but I'd be lying. I, I enjoyed myself out there. Yes, we, uh, Mrs. Adler did okay. At shopping? Yes, at yes. shopping. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Don't mention it. I would ride with you again, Mrs. Adler, if you will ride with me. Maybe. <laughs> if you prove you can handle yourself. Well, okay. they say I lack finesse, but... I ain't afraid of gun smoke. <laughs> oh, we got this, Arthur. You've already done me a big favor today. Okay, Miss High and Mighty. And nice pants, by the way. Oh, shut up. Nice pants? Yeah, she got herself some pants. Looks great. What are you doing, Pearson? Posted that letter for you. 
Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Anytime. Okay. I'm assuming I need to wait to talk to Pearson about other things. Let's see. Donate. I can donate. What can I donate? A stew without good meat is I can no donate. All, Mr. Morgan. Sure, and singing's fine, but I'm done with hmm. that. If you want me to leave, then that's fine. I can Make donate fish. Head. That's interesting. Just a matter with guts. Do Should I God, damn, donate any of this stuff? I can donate one. Here, you can have one. One fish. And one meat. Just there you go. Side, that's Mr. all you Morgan. get. Good Crafting job, upgrades. Morgan. That's what I want to see. Arthur, don't forget, I'm more than happy satchel. If you bring me the right material. Okay, kit satchel. What is that? Increased carry capacity for all types of kit equipment that will be used regularly. And then valuable satchel increases carrying capacity for types of valuables that can be Remember, sold for cash. So we need fly, deer, beaver, like and rabbit pelts. And also elk and panther? Okay, well, I'll we'll do our best. Me the right materials before I can make that. I'll keep my eye out for some good material. So I do need to do some cooking, right? Where can I cook? I can cook somewhere. That's the stew. But there's a cooking fire. <laughs> How you doing, somewhere. Arthur? Fine, Micah. Oh, good. hi, Micah. I've been worried about you. Have really you? Have. Me? Why? Oh, you know, just the usual reasons. I'm here for you, brother. The thing is, we all gotta die. Huh. Okay. Risky kind of morning. <laughs> Excuse me? We all gotta die, but you got the chance to live. Not just to live, to live for love. Arthur will tell you, we all gotta die, but Are you gonna love, love is the thing. The only thing. Hmm. What, what was that? I got hand. No movement. goddamn clue what you're on about, Hosea. You're not as dumb as you act, John Marston. I don't understand. Be a man, John. It would suit. It you. would suit you. <laughs> oh no, hey Fion. Oh my god, I'm enjoying this game a lot. Right you haven't now. been able to get satchels yet. You suck at getting the ingredients. It seems kind of hard to do. It just seems like, for one, you have to go find the animal, and then you have to find an animal that's capable of giving you a perfect pelt, and then you actually have to, like, use the proper weapons and then shoot it in the proper place. They don't make it easy. That's a lot of steps. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. I've lost Welcome to the witch's lair. Lost it entirely. You've lost it? Nice to see you too, Reverend. Okay. I used to be an intellectual. Now I'm just a fool. Okay. Well... <laughs> I've always been happy as a fool. Fair enough. You all just laugh at me. I know you do. What? Oh. All right, well, okay. I should be getting on. What was I that? Hmm. Can I do any cooking by the campfire? Yes, morning, I can. Arthur. Good morning. Yeah, Micah. Yeah, morning. Oh, I can't well, actually do any cooking? Abigail. Oh, never mind. I can just sit there. That's kind of funny. I can do cooking somewhere in here, right? Help. What's your provisions? I guess it would be over at, like, the provisions? Is there a fire? Not sure there is. Mr. Guess there's Morgan. not. Wait, I can pick up a bucket? Am I supposed- is that a chore? I'm wondering if that's a chore. Am I supposed to bring that somewhere? Yes, I am. It is a chore. All right, let's go do a chore, and then we'll go rob a homestead or something. Those ones are kind of fun. Even though I was not expecting to go, like, murder everyone on the homestead and then rob it, I thought we were just doing, like, a robbery, but it turns out we did a murder and a robbery, which I feel a little bit misled, but, you know. Not at Camp Pearson Cooks the Camp. Oh, so you can't. Okay. Okay. Cook in the wilderness with camp and stuff. Okay. All right, let's top up the water in the wash bin. Got to make sure everyone's washing. Can't have camp smelling horrible. We are real close to the river. I feel like there would be a lot of bugs. 
Hope we have some kind of bug spray or something, you know? How are you? Fantastic. Mm, is that not where I need to bring it? Can I talk to you a minute? Not again, Abigail. What? Not ever. Not Just ever. Leave me alone. Leave me alone? Please. That's your wife. You're pathetic. You're a pathetic man, John Marston. Uh-oh. Don't I know it? Uh-oh. All good. Oh, and we got dead eye leveled off that. Cool. Just what did you say to me? Well, I, what? I didn't do it. Well, John and Abigail seem to be having some problems. I definitely have a different perspective on John than the first game. What do you think? What do you mean? About those two families. The rich ones in the big houses. I don't know. Go have a look around. See what you can find out. Calmly, I mean. Calmly. Sure. Mm-hmm. Dutch and I. What? We both think there's money to be made. I hope so. I'll see what I can find out. <laughs> okay, anyways. Um <laughs> my commentary. <laughs> Thank you. You never had to worry that Jack would fall off a cliff? That's fair. You can. Scout camp is behind Strauss's tent. Oh. Let's go over there. Let's check it out. Thank you. Cause I remember in the last camp there was definitely like a little fire, right? Let's see. Looks like there might be something back here. Maybe, maybe not. Ha! Am Morgan. Mm, I know there was in the last camp. Oh, is that it? Is that it up there? I think that's it. Up the hill. Okay, perfect. All right, I want to cook our fish before the fish go bad, and then we'll be on our way. I think we'll go do the homestead thing next. That sounds fun. Okay, let's... Let's make our fish, and we can use... What? Well, I don't know. Time fish? Sure. Sounds yummy. Speaking of yummy, cooking stream tomorrow. I think I'm gonna make some lobster bisque for the first time. Sounds very yummy. Gonna go fishing. I wish you could fish for lobsters. That's not really how it works. You don't use a fishing pole for a lobster, I don't think. Um, what's going on here? I think it's being a little bit weird. Okay, can we? Here we go. It's figuring itself out. We'll give it a sec. Cook another. No, nope, we can't cook another yet. Flaky fish. Sure, let's let's do. How many of these do we have? Not many. Let's just do plain flaky fish. So I should cook everything, right? I'll just sit, I'll spend a moment and we'll sit here and cook everything. We should also maybe eat something. Those are such pretty horses. Nico's gonna cook too. <gasps> Nico, are you gonna are you gonna cook something too? Let's see, I'm gonna eat that one. And we'll cook another, and I think this should be the last one. A fish at least. We've been doing a decent amount of hunting, so we, we've got a decent amount. Okay, we'll just do the big game. Wham bam. At least this doesn't go bad. You guys spend a lot of time in this game, like kind of cooking and doing like downtime things. I feel like always in like the games that like I really love, like I, it is worth it to take the time to like slow down and let's see, yeah, time big game, sure. Do I have to just slow down, do like the, the little cooking things or do the side quests and the little chores and 
I don't know. It just makes the game feel really, like, alive and immersive. Let's see. Big game meat. Why can't... Oh, I can't do... I, I need to have more plain big game. Okay, I can't make more of that. Good to know. Mm, I can cook one. Sure. You just discovered you can cook at camp. You thought it was always Pearson cooking. Oh my gosh. They don't make it very obvious. So, fair enough. There's a lot of little things in this game that they don't make it obvious. So I appreciate you always helping me out. It'd be kind of nice if there was like bulk cooking. But I understand that there's not. And this game does like its realism. And that's not very realistic. <clears throat> I don't know. I'm sure for a lot for a lot of you guys who play this game a lot, I'm sure it feels like, you know, me watching someone play Skyrim for the first time. We're just like, oh my gosh, you know, like you don't know anything yet. Just wait. I love that feeling. You haven't played this one, but you go hunting in Skyrim. Fair enough. Honestly, I never went hunting that much in Skyrim. Not as much as I maybe should have. Let's keep going. We're almost done with our meat. It's gonna be like the cooking stream tomorrow. We're just gonna be hanging out. Maybe I need a drink. Maybe I should grab a drink. I don't need one. But maybe I want one. Mm, I can cook three of those. Yeah. I might as well just finish it now. Prime beef. So, lobster bisque tomorrow, and then also maybe, like, prime rib, if I can manage to figure that out and see if, like, the timing for the two of those things works. Because a lot of times I, I plan my recipes based on, like, how the timing is going to work. Like, if I do two recipes at once, I got to make sure that the timing is going to work out. I was going to do a stew. And I still might do a stew, but it, um, if, I, if I make a stew inspired by Red Dead, I'm thinking that's going to be more like a like a TikTok or a YouTube short video um, because it takes like seven hours to make. So that, that'll be like an all day sort of situation. Hmm. Lots of red and hello. The hunting guild mod? Ooh, a hunting guild for Skyrim. Sounds cool. All right, almost done with our cooking. What will I pair it with drink-wise? That's a great question. I'm gonna have to take a look. I don't know. All right, we finally did all of that. Let's see, crafting, what else can we craft? We can craft fire bottles, that's kind of fun. Horse care. We can craft a snake oil. Sure, let's craft a snake oil for the road. Let's do it. Arthur. Hello. All right, I'm ready. Remember when everyone made the stew IRL? It sounds fun. There's some good crockpot stew recipes out there. Since we don't have an open campfire, that will probably have to be the next best thing. <laughs> All right, I think we're ready to go on an adventure. Hey, Arthur. Maybe I should grab more ammo before we go. That sounds like a good idea. Hello, Kieran. You behaving there, Driscoll? I'm not no Driscoll, sir. Oh, he does not like that. How are the horses? Okay. Uh, I mean, well, but they could be better. I'm worried. They, they, they've been through a lot. True. If I had some burdock root, just a couple, uh, I could knock up a poultice, could keep them well, and cure some ailments. Okay. Burdock root? Yes, yes, that, 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 that works best. Okay. If I see some, I'll bring it you. Well, thank you. Do we, do we have sir. some of that? We <laughs> should. I think we do. Let me see. Can I, can I give it to him? 
There we go. For the horses. Okay, I'll catch you later then. You didn't even say anything? Right, okay, well, hope it helps. Um, okay, here's our locker and everything. Oh, we gotta grab our hat from our horse. Uh, looks like we need to go buy some more ammo for the camp. We'll get there. We'll do that later then. Okay, it's time to go do some robin. Let's do this. Hey, Tiger Fangs. Hey, Jaws. Good to see you both. How's it going? Home robbery. Okay, let's hope that this doesn't turn into like a giant murder fest like it did last time. The guy was like talking about how, all about like, oh yeah, there's this homestead. I know this. All of these people telling us all about these people. And then we just go murder all of them. I'm just like, okay. Okay. Well, um, take your time playing this masterpiece. Welcome, Christian. I, we're definitely... I want to just take my time. I want to check out these side quests. I want to see all this side dialogue. That's definitely the most interesting part, for sure. Played through this game twice so far. The first playthrough will always be the best. I'm sure there, there's that that cool exploration feeling, but I I don't know. I'm someone who loves like the second playthroughs of things when like it's you're not so familiar with the story that like you know everything but like you know generally what ends up happening so you get to go back and like look for the details and look for like the build up and you know look for like the little clues and hints and stuff so fun um give me a quick second guys i'm gonna go run to the kitchen go grab myself a drink i might go grab a beer or something um but yes i'm talking about the home robbery with javier yes that one was kind of brutal so this is with sean i guess so we're gonna see how it goes with sean um, but give me just a minute, guys. I'll be right back. Go grab yourself a drink or something if you need, and, uh, we'll keep going. Stretch break time. Be right back. All right. Thank you very much for waiting. I have returned, and we are ready to keep going with our Red Dead 2 playthrough here. All right. So, chapter three has been going well so far. I feel like... We're leading up to more things happening here. I don't know. So we're in a new camp. And we're about to go do a nice home robbery. So Sean's got something for us, it looks like. And we're going to go rob a homestead. Yeah. So tell me, is your people uh, Jacobites or English lovers, Arthur? My people were peasants. We had no time for politics. My dad would say that no politics was politics. That old world bullshit, it ain't got no place here. Oi. Wait. I jumped into that way too fast. Cheers, everyone. We got Tom Nook here. Thanks for joining tonight. I hope you guys are having a lovely one. To a lovely community. All right. Swiped hello. Um... You like watching streamers play these games because you hear all the foreshadowing and the dialogue, right? Goes right past you on the first playthrough. I love that kind of stuff. Catch those details. All right. Anyways, nice home robbery time. <laughs> because there ain't no judgment here. Most folks hate the Negroes. They hate the Redskins, the Jews, even us Irish. <laughs> you ain't so free of politics. I hate everyone just the same. <laughs> okay. Well, in that case, you're going to want what I just found for us. What's that? Arthur, right around, very couple of days back, I come across this old cabin. A couple of fuckers lazing about outside, all liquored up. <laughs> I didn't think nothing of it. But then I come across this hunter down by the river. He tells me they're a stick-up crew. Says they hit a train a couple of days back near Emerald Ranch. Nice fella he was, shared a bottle we did. Then I robbed the bastard blind. <laughs> and you believed him? No reason not to. If he's right, it'll be a big haul for us. I saw three of them, maybe more, but I reckon you and me... You could take them real easy. All right. What the hell? Let's go check it out. Yeah, <laughs> let's go. Them sons of bitches think they're mean? <laughs> they're about to get a lesson in mean. You just keep your cool, you hear me? All right, we get to see more of Sean. Hey there, girl. Roy, follow me. Hey. All right, let's go. Time for some robberies. Look out. I'm you're not going fast enough. I'm just holding A. How far is this place? It's a bit of a ride. Not too bad. Back up north to stretch. 
Not far from the state line. All right. So, what were you doing riding around up there anyway? Sniffing around, looking for a take. I got a long nose for these things. Dutch has always honored us to get out there and bring in money, ain't he? And rightly so. I ain't like some of them others back there, sitting around waiting to be told I go after it. Good I for see you. you sitting around <laughs> plenty. I mean, I don't need no content <laughs> like the rest. Oh, Dutch knows my in. value to the cause. As from the moment I met him, you tried to kill him, if I remember oh. the story right. And he kept me around, didn't he? He saw something in me. He said as much. I'm sure. You need to get a perfect deer pelt but things another people. time. And while we're talking about money, you are clear on how this works. We split half. Other half goes to the gang. Dutch keeps all our savings hidden in a safe spot outside camp. Yeah, yeah, I know. How many times do you have to tell me? Well, what's that box by his tent for then? Camp funds. Great voice. Supplies and the like. <laughs> The fact you don't know that suggests you clearly ain't put much in it. But always pay me way. Don't you worry. You're sure you scoped this place out right? Yeah, is yes, this a good idea? See? That's why I wanted you along for this. You're still a doubter. I ain't just some dumb kid. I've lived a lifetime of shit already. And you sure don't keep it bottled <laughs> up inside. What about that train job with the oil wagon? Made a good show in there, didn't I? You got knocked out. Ah, that's what you choose to remember. We got paid. We got out of there. Got knocked out in Blackwater, too, didn't you? <laughs> now that was bloody chaos. I want to know more about what happened there. Did you get split off with Mac? I mean, we more or oh, less know, didn't but... Didn't see him. I lost your boys at some point when he was getting out of town. They caught up with Mac a couple of days after. Davy was finished by the time we got up the mountains. Jenny didn't even make it that far. Oh. Those bounty hunters strung me up, beat me, pulled teeth, torn me feet. I didn't breathe a word about nothing, I swear. Good. Wow. It's time folks stop giving Dutch a hard time I'm about all that Blackwater business, if you ask me. The man's not a fortune teller. You can plan, you can use your head. But you never really know what you're I don't know about into. witches in this time, but there yeah. certainly were fortune tellers. Folks always want to blame someone when things go wrong. How far is it now? Not too much for them. Better be worth it. Hey, you need is that this it? Actor. I don't even know what I'm here to no more. You're <laughs> out throwing lead with Sadie Adler. Helping the law chase down criminals? All right. That'll have to wait. We're nearly there. His voice is reminding me a little bit of Shea Gorath's voice. All right. It's going to be off the Shea Gorath from Skyrim. Anyone else hear it? Like, especially in that last phrase that he just said. I'm sitting here, I'm like, who does he remind me of? And that last oh, phrase just gave it to me. Mm -hmm. Robbing passerby pretty profitable if you don't mind murdering people for a dollar occasionally. Maybe a future playthrough? Yeah. I don't know. That's a little. That's. Let's make sure we keep one of them alive to tell us. I'm trying to be honorable. I'm not very good at it. Doing. But I'm trying. You really sucked at robbing people in this. Your bounty would leave you broke. Yeah, you gotta watch out for that bounty and make sure that, uh, that the crime is actually worth it. it does cut into profits a bit. Look, there's one on the outside. This is good. Luckily, murdering it someone is, is only like fifteen dollars. To me, I'll do the talking. You hang back. It's when you start murdering more people to cover up, cover up for the initial murder. You know that that's when it starts to get messy. About five seconds what? to get the hell off my property, boy. Uh, look, we don't want no trouble. We just thought you might like to know we passed the big posse of lawmen headed this way. There were a dozen of them coming up east. What? Where? 
Oh. Right here. Oh. 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 What? What? Come on. We got more coming out of the woods. Bam. Come on. Come on. Die. You're the only one left. Give it up now. Okay, okay, I give up. Don't you? I ain't armed. Okay. Threaten. If you want to leave, you'll tell me where that money stash. Yeah. Well, all right, all right, take it easy. Behind the, the wall in the bedrooms, if you stick your hand between the gap. All right, you go grab the money. I'll keep an eye on sunshine here. Okay, let's check it out. Check it out. Let's see. Oh, we can loot. Don't look back. Just a little bit, a little bit of quick, quick looting. Just don't mind me. Just gotta, gotta grab, grab this their their money and their stuff real fast here. I am turning to the low honor lifestyle, one accidental incursion at a time. I don't know what you're talking about. I would never ever be low honor ever. Oh, here we are. You got some good stuff. <sighs> Why don't you see what else you can find, Sean? What else we got? Wait, did he kill him out there, or did he let the guy go, or like? Oh, you we take him, no problem, didn't uh... he? You did good. Let's see what the pay is first. Go get up all by myself. A proper lead. All right. Hmm, I can't all carry right. any more gin. Guess we better drink some gin. Didn't realize. You heard him, right? He said the stash was behind a loose board in the bedroom. There we go. Now I can take more gin. You find anything yet? Don't want to overstay our welcome, <laughs> do we? Um, inspect stash box. Hey, Sounds nice. It's over there. That's a new gun. Cool. What'd we get? Double action revolver. Cool. So, did I did I get it? Did I pick it up? Is that how that works? Is hmm. okay. I think it's good. I guess I dropped the cattle in. That's fine. And I don't need any more of those. Remove plank. Hidden stash. How much? Hey, this is more like it. Good he let work. the guy go. Okay, hey, that's good. What about my car? I found a place, didn't I? All right, here. But don't forget to give the camp its share. Supplies don't appear by magic, you know. All right. True. Don't need to lecture again. I'll see you back at camp. All right. How yeah, how much? What folks got stashed. Twenty bucks. <laughs> Just gotta be other places. Twenty bucks. Out there like this. Twenty bucks. Hmm. You can discover homesteads by exploring the world. There will be lucrative something. Okay. How do I get those tips to stay for like a moment longer? I gotta read them immediately. Um, is that... That's a cigarette card. Nice. Gotta keep an eye out. Prominent American set. What's that on the ground? Nothing. Let's get out of here. Well, that's a new cigarette card set. That's fun. Ooh, moonshine. Gotta take that. Is this anything? Nope, that's nothing. Looks like there's one other person we can loot. Bring the new gun. Your old gun magically teleports to your camp wagon. That is wonderful. Alternative alcohol storage systems. Just drink it. What's that noise? Twenty dollars was a lot back then. I mean, yeah, but like, a lot of these robberies have gotten a lot more than twenty bucks. Come on. <laughs> I can't really complain. It's fine. All right, we got a stranger up here. Let's go. 
I do appreciate that they put a lot of these like stranger missions near the places that you're already going to be going. I appreciate that. Who are we going to encounter? Easy there, girl. Who's around here? Found someone. Really dark. Hello? Who are you? What the devil are you looking at? Hello? I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. I'm ruined. You're ruined. Ruined. Oh no. How so? It's a disaster. Oh no. He's British, of course. Who what wants to see a woman wrangle wild animals who doesn't have any bloody wild animals? Come to America, they said. Come to the land of opportunity, they said. Sod you, Daddy, I said. I'm going to America to make it on the stage. <laughs> I don't want to be in the army. Ooh. Now look at me. The old git will have a field day. I didn't really understand any of that. I had an act. The bravest woman in the world. The animal wrangler. Watch her tame wild beasts. And you were the woman. Of course I was the bloody woman. Look at me. What? It's the stage. Look at Grease me. Paint. Tears. No one wants to see a man wrangling wild animals. And no one what? wants to see a woman wrangling nothing. <laughs> Can I borrow your gun? Okay. I want to shoot myself. What is this guy doing? See, what? I'm buggered. What? what? My animals, they escaped. And now I'm... I'm Do you need help? What, what escaped? Yeah, a what escaped? A tiger escaped? Of the Hindu Heights. And you're not more a concerned about that. elusive zebra from the plains of Ongo Bongo by the shores of the Limpopo. Okay, can I keep the zebra? And a magnificent lion. And the, the there's a lion and a tiger Tangier. that are just on the loose. Yeah, I see your problem. They're pretty hard to come by around here. Yeah. Listen, friend. Help a fellow out, would you? I'm beyond desperate. If you see any of them, will you bring them back here? If I see a tiger or a lion or a zebra just roaming around. Exactly. If, well, I believe the zebra's up near Lonard Sod, distinctive creature that he is. I'll make it worth your while. Okay. Right. Madam. Madam. It's bloody Margaret, not Madam. What? <laughs> Margaret. What? Mistress of fucking danger. What is this guy? Oh my god. Amazing. Amazing. Uh, Margaret. Okay. All right. We got we got Margaret's next step of the quest up there. We got Leopold. Weapons forbidden there. Yep, Grays. Okay, we got some business to attend to. Let's go. Broomstick. Girl. Let's fly. How many times can I say that this playthrough? I don't know. We're gonna find out. <laughs> what? And bears in the woods? Yeah, so not only are there bears in the woods, now there is a loose lion and a loose tiger and then also a zebra. My immediate thought pulling up to that little carriage thing was it immediately, the visuals reminded me of The Last Unicorn. If you guys have seen that from like the year 1980. Um, if you've never seen it, highly recommend it. It's kind of a weird movie though, but like it's fantastic. And um, it just reminded me of like the old creepy witch lady that was keeping like the unicorn locked up in a very similar sort of setup to that. I don't know. Immediately gave me that vibe, especially with the magician. Um, there is a magician in that in that movie too. So, anyways, if anyone knows what I'm talking about, yes or no? <laughs> you remember that, right? Yeah. We watched the last unicorn on a Discord night. What was that? Like two years ago now, or something? I don't know. That was a while ago. What is call out? Hey, partner. Hello. Hello. Goodbye. About. Ooh, I need a deer. Okay, I gotta get him right in the head. Ooh! Alright, I'm getting used to this dead eye thing. Okay, I need a perfect deer pelt. Wait, did we get it? Was that three stars? Did it say three stars? I only saw that for long enough to see that there were stars that I could see without skinning it. <laughs> oh. No, it's only a good deer pelt. Dang it. That's okay. That's something. Okay, we gotta keep going with this quest, though. 
We'll see if we happen to come upon a trapper. That would be ideal. But it was not a perfect pelt, which is unfortunate. So that just means that the animal was not perfect quality to begin with. Right? Because I shot it in the head with the bow. Hey there, mister. Hello. Goodbye. You love the 80s. Back then, weird was perfectly normal. Fair enough. True. What's this? Another side quest? Let's find out. Margaret's missing. Oh, no, this is the zebra. Oh, it just is bringing me right here. Okay. Where's the zebra gonna be? We need a lasso. And we need to spot a zebra. Can't imagine that's gonna be too difficult, though it is nighttime. And that's making it more difficult. Maybe just over this ridge? Slow it up. There's a camp there. Yeah. What's going on at this camp? I don't know if this is any of my business. Come on, let's go. Get yourself off my ranch now. Oh, this is your your ranch? Okay. Goodbye. I'm going. Goodness. Is that a zebra? No. That is not a zebra. Is that a Yeah. That is a zebra. No, 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 no. Wait, I didn't catch it? Oh, gosh, dang it. Okay, no, we gotta catch up. Oh, oh! Is that a is that a donkey painted to look like a zebra? Oh. Do I? I'm gonna hop off. Come here. Wait, 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 wait! No, 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 no! No, no, no! Hang on. Can we can we calm down a little bit? Hey, it's okay. Oh, you seem sweet. Can I ride? A mule. Oh, these drugs better not rub off on my pants. Oh. Take the mule. It's cute. Okay, wait. We need a lantern. Where's my lantern? Come on. There we go. Those are boars. No, I gotta stay focused on one mission at a time. But I know I do need a boar pelt. Okay, hang on. I want a waypoint. Margaret's camp. There we go. Aw, the poor mule! A horse with a custom paint job. The zebra has been calmed and will now follow you. Aw. Aw. What a sweet, sweet zebra mule. <laughs> Oh, this is a genuine mule, <laughs> or a genuine, excuse me, a genuine zebra, for sure. I don't know why I got those mixed up. <laughs> Last unicorn was 15 months ago, was it? Okay, that was not two years, but that was a good while ago. I have to use a sniper on them. Each animal has their set weapon to use to get perfect. Oh. Oh, okay. So you have to use the right yeah. weapon. Stop here a minute. Broomstick, you still coming? Yeah. This funny to you? <laughs> this funny to you? Is that what he's saying? <laughs> to the mule? Oh my goodness. Okay, 
Okay, but can I take this mule? Can this mule be mine now? Can I ask him for it? him our zebra <laughs> well you can call him that <laughs> although he's as much a zebra as you are a lady animal wrangler <laughs> oh dear you're missing the point aren't you it's an illusion a trick of the eye to bamboozle the senses confound comprehension hoodwink your audience hoodwink our audiences <laughs> dear boy don't be so dreadfully literal no one will pay for the truth they only pay for deception it's like the last the unicorn Lord even of more. Stage. Dreams and reality. Ah. What is the greater conjuring trick? Lassoing some poor beast on the plains of Mumbo Jumbo land and shipping it here so it can dance the polka. No, don't put it back in the cage. There. Wait, could I have brought the mule to a stable instead? Something mundane into something extraordinary. It's the difference between prose and poetry. I don't wanna... It's alchemy. We're selling dreams, dear boy. Well, as long as... <laughs> as long as you don't pay me with tickets to your show. Ah, uh, yes. Well, I don't know if I should have brought these animals back to you. Of course, of course. I shall make it worth your while. But, um, first, hmm. we shall need the whole menagerie back before we before can... Before I get paid? That. At all? My assistant's gone for the tiger. Tiger? Yes, yes. And taken our remaining lion. So are they going to be a real lion and tiger? They're down or... there in Caligo Way. Please. Or... I hate to ask. All right. I'll see what I can do. All right. Let's go. Let's help him out. He's British, of course. Part two. Margaret's zebra. Zebra. Found on the plains. Let's see, let's see. Alright, down here next. Let's move. Bill and Ted was only four days ago. That's true. We'll have another Discord movie night this Saturday. So if you guys want to join us for this nice little movie night, we'd love to have you. It's a nice cute little fox. So, do all the little random houses and stuff have something to rob? I'm assuming most of them do. Even if it's not very exciting. I'm assuming the bigger the homestead, the more stuff they have to rob. Would be my, my general assumption. Yep. Yeah, there's a girl. Oh, this... I think our horse needs... Some... Needs, needs an apple. You're okay, girl. <laughs> Good broomstick. <laughs> You'll be there. That was good. I'll be this Saturday night in Discord. I, uh, I at everyone in the movies channel. So if you guys want that notification, make sure to turn that on. All right, what do we think this next animal is gonna be? What am I going after, the tiger next? Do we think it's gonna be like a, like one of the cougars? Maybe painted like a tiger? I could see that. That is quite a squeal. What in the oh. world? Oh, what because did I just come up on? Whoa! 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 What do we do here? To the Can I do something? Oh my goodness! Dwayne, thank you so much for the raid! Welcome, everyone! Thank you so much for joining us tonight. How are you? Oh my gosh! And Magic Dude, thank you so much for subbing. Appreciate that so much. Thank you so much for supporting the stream here. Welcome officially to our Witchy Coven. Hope you enjoyed the emotes, the stream, the community. Great to have you part of it. Well, welcome on in, Dwayne and community. How are you all this fine evening? If you guys want some amazing Microsoft Flight Simulator content, flying around, amazing vibes, go check out Dwayne Kate's stream. Um, what were you all up to tonight? 
Let's see, riding into the middle of them unprepared is not optimal. Yeah, so 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 there's a bit of a situation in in, in our game at the moment. Um, we, we've come across some some unfortunate unfortunate NPCs here, and I need I need a plan of action. Um, <laughs> I need a plan. What is my plan? What does everyone recommend? What do I do? What do I do? What 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 do I do here? Riding into the middle of them unprepared. That is a bad idea. I'm gonna get super killed. So we gotta we gotta figure this out. What is my plan of attack? Um, but welcome everyone. If you don't know me, I'm Paige the Witch. This is my first playthrough of Red Dead Redemption, and we just started Chapter Three tonight. So we got we we got we gotta do something about 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 these guys here. So um, let let's just let's ha let's take a plan of attack. Dwayne, how's your stream today, though? Yeah, we we gotta go shoot them. So, so so let me just move my horse. I don't want to get my horse involved in this. This is this is not Broomstick's business. Broomstick does not need to be exposed to this. Um. Th maybe this will get okay. So I'm gonna put this on. Make sure I don't get a bounty. Yes, sir. Let's get my repeater. Okay, and here's where we're just gonna bloop, bloop, bloop. Okay, I can't see very well because of this gosh dang tree, but here we go. That worked. That worked pretty nice. Oh, one of them got away. Wait, no, 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 come on. There we go. Come on. Got them all, right? Oh, we lagged a little bit, but I think we got them. Woo! <laughs> Oopsies. Uh, yeah, these, these, those, those were not good people there. So they are no longer a problem. Yeah. <laughs> Give me a, a, an excuse to take all of them out? Absolutely. They gave me the real, a real good excuse to take them out. So we're gonna, we're gonna take them out. We, we don't appreciate the, the racism. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Pretty sure you don't get negative karma, karma for it? No, we did not lose honor for that. Don't know if that had anything to do with the fact that we put a bandana on. Also, you know, I, I don't know if that affected it whatsoever. I think you're using dynamite when you find them. <laughs> That's a good one. I don't know if we have dynamite. We might have a stick of dynamite, but I think we used it. Okay, there's another back there. Not even worth it. I don't need your loot. Um, what's this horse? Pretty horse. Um, maybe I should just set the horse free? Yeah, yeah I'll just set the horse free. Broomstick, let's keep moving. Be free, my horse. Well, that looked fun. That was fun. <laughs> you don't lose honor by killing those stupid people. Okay, good. <laughs> You're gonna head to bed. Thank you again for the raid, Nico. Hope you have a great night. Have a good one. Oh my gosh, I hope the shift at the cat shelter is amazing. Oh wait, I wanna. I, I do wanna loot them real fast. Quick little loot, and then it looks like we got some kind of business on the lake there. Or the river. They light themselves on fire if you keep watching. Do they really? Yep. <laughs> That's kind of funny. <laughs> they pick up a document? Please, what document? Whoa. Is there a document? Did I miss something? I might have missed something. Stripey. Stripey? Is that a new horse? Hello. Did you? Hey, Mister. Oh. oh. Miss. Howdy, Mister. Did, uh, did you lose a tiger? Yeah, you found one. Nah, I found your caravan down the way. 
Uh, Margaret said that you might need a hand. Oh, he weren't wrong. That tiger's missing. I sent our best lion out to find him. What? And, our and best lion? I'm assuming the lion's a dog? It is a right old predicament. Your lion from uh, Timbuktu, weren't it? Oh, from Valentine, I think. He might be more of a kind of dog. Yeah, than it's a, a dog, yeah. But in <laughs> light, a feller could never tell. <laughs> of course. Of course, yeah. to go. Into them shrubs over there. Okay. Why don't you hop up on the well, I'm very happy that a I'll real lion and tiger didn't escape. Okay. That first set of shrubs, that's where I lost sight of them. I got Can I see anything? Okay. There's a trail. Got the trail! These are paw prints. I'm gonna move this wagon up. Okay, it looks like we keep going down this way. Looks like like blood. Hey. Blood. Ooh. Well, what's this? Okay. Hope the dog is all right. Oh, is that? No, no, no! Found your dog. No. Dog. No. Hey, boy. No, no, no. She just, just. I think a cougar took him. Oh, that'd be stripey. Yeah, it's a, it's a cougar. And I always thought they got along. What? Your tiger is a thought wild they got along? Uh huh. She sent a dog yes. after a, a mountain a lion. Oh, yes, sir. She's our star attraction. Well. Let's hope it wants the other half of its dinner. No! No! He did not just pick up the dog! The other half? Really? I'm gonna put him in your wagon. No! You find somewhere to hide. Oh. Well, I'm no. behind that log then. Okay. Scrubs <laughs> up. Oh, Stay goodness. down. She won't be too far away. Come quick. I went out to find a tiger. Cougar, you mean? And I end up losing a lion. <laughs> yeah, dog. The cougar is an actual mountain lion. Well, like if that's, that's what you're dealing close with. Close enough. You didn't have any luck to begin with. Cougars and dogs. Hey, it ain't what you got in this life. It's what you make of it. Well, that's very wise of you. Especially when you're lacking zebras and tigers. Hey, keep your head down. It's coming. Look, I really don't think she'll eat the dog. No, she like will. I said, they was friends. No, they weren't. I'm worried for your horses now. Oh, I guess she's real hungry. She's feral. I'm not go, 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 go! Quick, quick, Arthur, quick! Quick! Oh, wait, but yeah, why are we locking her in? That's kind of messed up with us. I don't... Right. Mm. Let's go. Like, I kind of feel bad okay. helping. Drive, will you? And I'll keep an eye on her. Sure thing. Yep. Let's get her back to Mr. Margaret. Broomstick, you coming? Oop, 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 Mister. oop, oop, oop. Sorry, I'm just... Still oh no, that's terrible. I ran I them over. Thought, since they were close and all... Uh, wild creatures turn on each other. Ah! No looking at chat and driving. The next. This is this comes easy. I mean, I should know. I've run with a few of them myself. Is that right? No, not really. Hey, uh, I realize this mountain lion is way too calm. Myself. Cougar is just chilling. Arthur Morgan. Nice to meet you, sir. Tell me, Miss Nice Nash, to meet you, Sally. How do you end up in this wreck? I, I guess it's always been my inclination, you know? Wild beasts and the like. I met Mr. Margaret, we got to talking, and you can probably tell in this field he's the ace of spades. He's a card, all right. It's my modest hope one day to be the world's second bravest woman animal wrangler. 
Yeah, you're pretty brave. I don't know if that's a good thing always, so. but you are. Top five at least. Maybe too brave sometimes. It depends on how many more fellers throw their hat in the ring. Maybe oh, one of these days, the best female for the job will actually be a female. <laughs> oh, I don't know if that'll ever happen. We lost the main road around here when the dust was up. Be careful or you might get wrecked too. Okay. You know the only thing to do in a dust storm is wait it out. Mr. Margaret's a lot of things, but best female navigator ain't one of them. I uh, imagine you're right about that. We was tearing around here, looking for any kind of landmark, when over we go. Whole caravan toppled. Found each other and some shelter, Oop. but when the wind died down, the animals Ah, broomstick, gone. yep, we're slowing down a little uh, bit. Now they're back. Some of them, at least. Thanks to you. Oh, uh, you would have managed Most of them. yourself. I just helped you along. The poor dog. You ever want to get inside, Joe? I, li I would like this lady more if she I'm hadn't sure sent the dog after the cougar. Like you. I'll leave the professional theatrics to better women than me. All right. I see you found each other. Sure did, Mr. What a Margaret. quest. Jolly good, jolly good. You know, tarn and feathering a donkey is one thing. I beg your pardon? It's grease paint. Makeup. But playing dolls dressed up with a grease? wild animal, you're going to want to be good. a lot more careful. Strappy ate King, Mr. Margaret. I saw her do it. I always thought they got along. Oh, she liked him just fine. She licked her chops and asked for seconds. Hey, speaking of which, you got any more word on that uh, runaway line, or are you gonna pay me for these misfits? Look, I'm well aware that we're not Royal Command performance material. Daddy, you were right, goddamn you! My <laughs> car barn in Rhodes is hardly <laughs> dreary, bloody lame. You got any word on the lion? Yes, yes, I've got word on the lion. Shit is the word. Someone saw him near Emerald Ranch. As you know, so there's we're another lion? Very short on lions. So. I'd be very There's another grateful. dog? All kinds of grateful. There's only one kind of grateful I care about. <laughs> so long, mister. Be a dear and fix me a gin. Fix uh. me a gin? Well, I hope maybe that we can end up rescuing these animals at the end of this. We'll see. A real lion. Let's find out. Uh, I don't know. Let's see. Hey, like on. Welcome, welcome. And Hello. Xander, hope you have a great night. Thanks so much for joining. Hey. Yeah. All right, let's see what this guy's. I, I really thought we had just found all three of them, but no, I guess they have another lion. But they already had. A lion outfit on the dog, which was arguably very cute, but not very effective. Yeah. That's a pretty horse. I know we're kind of we're on the lookout for the white horse, though. Oop, that's not what I meant to do. Let's pull out this just in case, though. Um, hey, Marky, it's good to see you. How's it going? Welcome back. Alright, what's yeah. this guy got? I, I really hope that I can uh, free the animals at the end of this, though. That poor mule. I liked the mule. I wonder if I could have taken it back to his stable. I wonder if someone's tried that. Don't tell me yet, because I want to know how this all ends up. We will see. When I, when I go find this third animal, though, whatever mystery animal this is going to be, um, we'll see what we end up getting. Let's try to beat the train here. So it says near the town. It can't be that bad. It's gotta be just a dog, right? For the lion. Is it gonna be a cow? Uh-oh. 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 
Hold your side! I am holding it! Hold it yours! Back. We got a cursed creature in here! Oh, yeah? It's as big as a mule and as mean as a hellcat! What's it in here? like a lion to me! What's in here? That's a dog in there! Uh-oh. Is it not gonna be oh. a dog? No. you excuse me. Uh-oh. Is step it gonna aside. be... Is it gonna be a rabid what? dog? I said step aside! Uh-oh. Uh oh, I have a feeling it's not gonna be a dog. Oh no, what's about to happen? What's about to happen? What's about to happen? Yeah, boy. Uh oh. Uh oh. Didn't look like no dog. Where'd my where'd my rifle go? I don't know. Come here, boy. I'm Let's gonna get go. a lasso. Those are some big paw prints. Uh oh. That sounds bad. That sounds like screaming. Okay, I guess we gotta go this way. Look what you've done. What? what did I do? Bitch. Uh, I'll, I'll take care of this. Wh what? Oh, don't tell me this is an actual real lion. Oh no, it's killing the horses. Uh oh. Okay, we need our horse for this. Okay, no, I'm going away from the center of the quest thing. Where is it? Where is it? Find the lion, yes, I'm looking for it. Where, where am I supposed to go? On this side of the barn? Nope. Definitely not. Okay, nope, sorry, wait. Okay, did it, did it stay in the barn? Stop, run for the stables. Staples. That's where I just was, wasn't it? I guess I just didn't go inside. It must, okay. Sweet mother. My horse is like, I'm out of here. Oh my God, that's a real lion. Okay, textures are doing a little bit of a weird thing. Why, why? shaky texture. Oh no. Wait, no. My bad. Okay, well, let's... Oops. 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 Um, oops. <laughs> well. Let's, let, let's, let's try again. We are super dead. I don't want to shoot it, though! It just goes straight for our throat. Uh-oh. 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 I don't want to shoot it, though. But I guess we kind of have to. I feel bad. I feel bad. I'm a terrible person. The poor lion. Is it dead? I pray that thing's a goner. Take a trophy. All right, I'll take my trophy. Poor lion. We just straight up cut off its paw. That's intense. Required to make the lion's paw trinket. Take this ingredients to the I've fence. I've never seen one of those before, and I hope I don't again. E yeah. 
Oh, poor thing. Okay, can I can I at least take it with us? Can I loot it? No, I can't. Okay, that was it. Oh no, worries. don't look, don't look. I won't look. What lovely weather. Okay then, girl. Well, dang, that was kind of brutal. Oh my gosh. So, do I go back to Margaret after that? I guess so. Okay, let's go report that his real lion is super dead. How did he let a real lion escape? Oh my god, okay. They definitely got me with this quest. You know, they get you with the fake tiger, the fake zebra, and then bam, real lion. So this guy did have two lions. He had a mountain lion and like a lion lion. Where did he get this lion? The poor thing, he didn't take proper care of it and it ended up dead. You let him kill you first time. I mean, yeah. Honestly, the lion, the lion deserves to kill us. It's, it's what it yeah. deserves, but you know, that's all right. Justice for the lion. You don't like these side missions that much. Some of these side missions are sad and kind of brutal. Like, oh my gosh, but they're interesting. And reflective of the, the sort of world this was at the time. He took the paw. That's fair enough. He could have, yeah, done. He, it could have been worse. I would love to do tarot card readings again. Yes, I've been thinking of doing one coming up soon. I gotta just pick a day and then plan some things out for sure. So welcome on in. Okay, guys. I need to go to a trapper soon. Odysseus returns. Sally, get the cages ready. Yes, sir, Mr. Market, right away. No. Man eating lion. You didn't think that it might be useful for me to know that this time the animal was actually real, you moron. Steady on. I clearly stated that we were looking you for You haven't clearly stated anything nope. in all the time I've known you. That could have been a goose for all I know. A knew. goose will hardly get them to their feet for the curtain call. Bring on the king of the beasts, on the other hand, and they feel the roar. And they, well, look about as surprised as you do. What have you done with him, if you don't mind me asking? I killed him. He's dead. Bloody hell. This is Rama, boy. Well, I guess I don't, made. I can't really lasso no, a lion. Amy. Yes, of course, of course. That's fair. I have just the thing. Upon th like thinking about that treasure. further. It is. You're a lucky oh, man. What's he gonna give me? Very lucky man. From the mines of El Dorado. Okay. As green as the rainforest. Is that a big giant emerald? As clear as the Amazon. And as dear as all the gold in the Andes. One man's labor is but a trifle compared to this jewel's true value. Wait. I shouldn't. What would Daddy say? Your what? Daddy ain't here. And we had a deal. Yes. Of course. A promise is a promise. Mm-hmm. Sally, get the wagons moving. Ain't we waiting for the lion? I wonder if we'll end up seeing He's them again. He's in the great hunting ground in the sky. Good day, sir. We've already Thank seen you. one NPC we that we helped randomly on yeah, the side of the road. So long. He let us put a gun on his so tab long, Mr. Morgan. in Next Valentine, time. which was cool. Bill, so, who knows who we'll end up seeing oh, later or not. Like, I wonder if we'll end up seeing that family again. And All right, we got a big giant emerald. That should be worth a pretty penny. Okay, let's take a look. He's British, of course. Part five, yes. Albert Mason's got something else for us again. Let's probably go over to him when we can. What is that? Fence? Oh, yeah, the fence was back up there. Um, I need to go to that fence soon. I kind of do. Let me go back up to that fence real fast. Well, that's kind of the opposite way that we're trying to go. No, I'll just go down to Albert Mason first. So, bait shop. What's at the bait shop? Is that worth going by? I went over there, like, that one time. Yeah. Like, day one. Super died in that swamp immediately. When you first played through, you didn't realize to take the lion's paw. Oh. So, did you miss the trinket? You were laughing when I pulled out the lasso. Yeah. Yeah, uh, upon further reflection, I, I think that lassoing a lion would go very poorly. <laughs> I, 
I'm way too willing to trust the lasso. I think the lasso is gonna get me out of any any situation. And unfortunately, against the lion, I think that that situation is not is it's not gonna happen. Or someone sees what? Both of you get your hands up. What's going on here? Oh. Oh wait, no, I didn't. That was the wrong guy. Wait, that's not. I just shot the wrong guy. Return this wagon to a wagon fence for a reward? A wagon fence? Oh, I think that's up in the direction. I'm assuming that's back where like the fence was, where I was just gonna go. Bait shop is for fishing supplies. Okay, I don't know if I need supplies yet. Probably not yet. <clears throat> okay, wagon fence. Sure. Where's a wagon fence? Up here, yes, it is where the regular fence is. All right, well, I did want to go up that way anyway, so here we go. I, I got my wish. Yep. All right, let's go. Happy we didn't get a bounty or anything for that. Oop. It's our wagon now. I wonder how much we get for this. Too bad I shot the wrong guy. Maybe I could have helped him out, but then we wouldn't have, uh, you know, gotten the wagon fence situation. I like all just like the random saddled horses you see around. I wonder how those horses in the wild end up getting their saddles off. I didn't say hello back. Now I look like one of those NPCs that doesn't say hello back to me when I'm offended. Now I'm that person. Okay, that body bag is technically getting out of the situation. Hmm. Oh, did I not call my horse? Dang it, I didn't bring my horse. Oh, broomstick, I thought I called you and I definitely didn't. Dang it. That means we're gonna have to save and reload the game to get our horse. That is unfortunate. What do you guys normally do, like, when you get in a situation where you forget your horse? Do you just go back every time when you realize, like, no matter how far you go? Or... What do you do? In we go. Come on, let's go, horses. Got some here for you. You steal a horse. Well, hang this. We run to the nearest stables. Fair enough. Deal. Spend it wisely. How much we get? So long. 40. Not bad. Definitely worth our time. Oh, unfortunate. Okay. Yep. Fence, please come back. Thank you. He was busy being the wagon fence. Dude, you gotta go around your, your crates. You keep trying to walk into... Oh, he's just going up and over. You see that? Well, business is business. Been a while since you were through here. Yep. Um, oh, we got a gold ingot. 300? Woo! Woo! Emerald 50? It's a unique item, though. It doesn't say that I should just sell it. I'm gonna hold on to that. Ground coffee, silver rings. I'm gonna sell all those. I don't think they have another use. That also doesn't say to be sold, so I'm gonna hold on to that. Maybe it will end up being relevant later. Can be sold. Can be sold. Can be sold. Can be sold. 
Perfect. All right. Remember you. And does Fast he have here some time ago, huh? anything to craft? My horse is there. Oh, did my horse follow? Maybe ride the trade train to Rhodes. Either Broomstick will be there at camp. Well, Broomstick followed us somehow. Don't know how. Definitely said the Broomstick was out of range, but beautiful Broomstick found her way to us. <laughs> okay, now we need to head down to Albert Mason because I want to go do all the side quests um, while I know that we can do them. Trapper's up there. I really should go to the trapper first. But... I can just go do Albert's quest, and I could just bring this deer back to... No, I I should really just go drop off this deer. I should drop off the deer. We've been holding this thing for a while. Let's go. Maybe we'll do some more hunting along the way. Or in the area. Happy this place seems to have recovered. They, they caught the horses. Looks like they were only down one horse. Yeah, that's my girl. Oh, good horse. And we haven't really taken the stagecoaches anywhere. Maybe should I take one of those? Nah, we're going to the trapper right now anyways. better to keep the treasure instead of selling it okay I was kind of wondering because it seems like one of those games where it would reward you for, for keeping it so good to know did I get the trinket Easy. oh is that who no I didn't get the trinket that's what you guys were saying he does the lion paw trinket mmm I did forget it I'm gonna keep going up to the trapper and then I'll just come back. Yep. See if we find some random quests there. along the road anyways. <laughs> Kept your cigarette cards until you collected all of them. They do respawn. Okay, that is good to know. Good to know it's not gone forever. That's probably what I would have thought. <laughs> So there's some more deer over there. I am looking for a perfect deer pelt. Do I need a Springfield rifle for that? Oh, that's not exactly what I meant to do. Yep. Don't think that's gonna be a perfect pelt, but let's check it out. Okay. I just pressed, I pressed that trigger, okay. Uh, I think I can still take the pelt even if I don't take the whole body. Sure, won't take long. Oopsies. Apparently the rifle was not not the right thing though. Bambi seeing the world from horseback, yeah. Uh-huh. Oops. At least we can store a couple pelts. Alright, sorry dear. I didn't really mean to shoot you like that. That was kind of a waste. My bad. Camp up here? Hey there. What's this? Hello. How you doing? Hi. What's up? Howdy. The fire's warm. You're welcome to share it with me. Oh, that's nice. Okay. Sure. You trust me then? Yeah. I'll Sometimes rest. Sometimes we must trust each other, even when we don't know each other. Very or else philosophical. We walk this life alone. Mm. All I know, you're a thief and a killer, but I rely on my instincts to tell me otherwise. Fair enough. Yes. I see in your eyes that you're not a bad man. Cook my venison. Like I was riding through the heartlands the other day, and caught through someone's land. Looked like an old pig farm. When a couple called me over from the house. Very nice man and woman. Very friendly. You would think this is fine, you know? Did you get a bad vibe? He's saying that a traveler like me deserves some rest and refreshment. Inviting me to stay for dinner. 
I was tired and I was hungry, but mi corazonada. The feeling in my gut said gut no. feeling says no. I don't know why, but I trusted it. Gotta trust it. Then the very next day, a man warns me to stay away from that place. Ooh. So I live by my instincts. I'm also real fast with a gun, which tells me when the instincts fail me. Fair enough. Well, I've sat long enough. You rest here as long as you need. Mm, I'm good. Let's see, can I take things? That's kind of nice. Oh, he's just leaving. Anything to take? Can I take any of those? Cut down? I can cut down the carcass? Can I take it? Yes, I can. Jackrabbit. Is that? Oh, it's a perfect rabbit pelt. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, Master Hunter, I definitely did that. Uh-huh. For sure. Here we go. We got the room. Yeah, we definitely need to go to the trapper now. Oop. And a duck. Guess we can't do the animation there. But we can pick it up. And we got honor for that. Alright, cool. Hi Sebastian, welcome. This is my first time playing this story. Oh, I can only replace the jackrabbit, but I think I can put it on the other side. Yes. Alright, we are loaded up. Okay, my girl. Maybe there was something else there, but that's okay. Uh um, we should go meet those fine- get that fine couple that he mentioned. Fair enough, the creepy people. We should find them. Springfield and headshot, it has to be a one-hit kill. Got it. And the long scope rifle. Okay, for the- for the deer. We just gotta aim properly. Easy there, girl. Okay, oh, oh, what, what, whoa, whoa. Good girl. Whoa, controls. Yep. Are we good here? Here we go. You done good. Broomstick. Girl. Why are we all squirrely? Just go go straight forward. Everything is okay, I promise. Yeah, there's a Alright, we're good. Mm, I'm not gonna try to hit these deer. Not until I go to the trapper first. Selling. Selling, right, please. Let's have a look. Good deer pelts yep. and the carcass and the poor deer pelts and the perfect rabbit and duck. Um, I'm gonna sell a couple of those because we have the max anyways. Done. Oh wait, one more thing. There's one more thing to sell. Right. Let's see. Can be sold. Mm. Fang from a cougar? Cougar fang, sure. All made what kind of horse is Broomstick? Broomstick is a thoroughbred. Did I feed Broomstick some whiskey? Not whiskey, but you know, that's actually funny. Back when I used to have my horse, um, my, my dad would sometimes be drinking a, a bottle of beer or something um, when we'd just be taking care of my horse and hanging out. You know, I'd be like grooming my horse after riding. My dad would come hang out and would set like a beer down somewhere. And my horse, without fail, every time, as soon as he got a taste of it the first time, every time he would find a beer, he would purposefully knock it over and then lick it up because he liked the taste of beer. <laughs> I don't sell to stores. You want my wares right here? The one place to find them. Okay, anything else I can get now? No, not yet. We'll get there. Any cool saddles or anything? No, we need cougar pelts or something. Beaver roping saddle. Interesting. Any items we can get? A tomahawk? Wish I never had to take my stall into the city. Reinforced equipment. 
Interesting. So we can get different equipment and stuff. Okay, so we gotta complete challenges in order to get access to this equipment. So like Master Hunter offhand holster reduces the amount of maintenance weapons required. So it looks like we can buy that. Guess I might as well, right? I should get anything I can, it seems. Explorer holster? Is that the same thing? Because we got the offhand holster. I don't think we need another holster. Herbalist? Do we get any herbalist things yet? Survivalist? No, I don't think we have anything else yet. Okay. All right. I want some. That horse has consumed more beer than I have. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that was my horse. He was a good horse. Oh my gosh. Um, Alright. Let's go. Broomstick, I want to give you a quick little brushing because you, you're all dirty. Let's get that blood off of you. Brush the blood away. Take a second. There it goes. Yep. You can't really see. It's behind there the camera. Go. Horses do love beer. It's true. Someone was chanting a curse on Broomstick. Oh my gosh, that's okay. Broomstick is protected against curses. Every it's fine. My is a little different, every pelt is Broomstick, a little here's different. some food, and let's You'll go. Find them else. Alrighty, we're making progress. Hey, Hash, how are you? Let's go get that trinket, shall we? See if we can get some more pelts while we're at it. I need to keep track of who wants which pelts, because it just seems like everyone wants a bunch of pelts. Maybe when I just have some time, um, when I'm not streaming. Hi there, mister. Hello. Uh, maybe I should just go do some hunting and try to get some pelts. That would be helpful. Main holster versus secondary one. Oh, so I can't have them both? Okay, I'll have to go get it. Next time, then. Is there anyone back up at this camp? Nope, not yet. Yeah. Well, that was a nice guy that was there. <laughs> Good girl. I could try this again. <laughs> Let's see. Does that work? Is that going to be perfect? It's only one star. I shot it with the Springfield rifle. I thought that's supposed to be the hunting rifle, and I shot it right in the face. Why is it only one star? I still don't understand this well enough, apparently. Was it just the deer? Was it just not a good deer? I don't know, it looks like a fine deer. I don't want to blame the deer. Okay, well, I got my dead eye, 50%. That's cool. Um, let's, let's stow that. my rifle clean? I don't know. Let's find out. Needs cleaning. Okay. Was that it? Does that affect the, the quality of the pelt? If it's not fully clean? Dang. Brutal. Um, Alright. I guess that's that. Was that it? I think that was it, right? Weapon is clean. Got it. How about my my other rifle? Hey there. Is that also clean? How clean is this one? Let's take a look. Um, does need cleaning. Let's clean it. I would assume we shot a lot of people with this rifle. We did. You can use binoculars to find the best animal to shoot. Wait, really? And the companion will say which weapon is the best for any given animal. <gasps> Good to know. Thank you for telling me. Yep. It was clean before. Oh. 
Try using Deadeye when taking the next shot if you have the ability to paint targets. That helps a lot, too. Okay. Let's see. Can I get a perfect rabbit pelt here, maybe? No, 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 no. I want the bow. No, I'm trying not to run it over. Bam, let's see. Did I do did I do good? I'm trying to hunt here. I think I did good. I think that said three stars. Love how he just literally rips the skin off. Uh, it was only good. Okay, well that's progress. Progress. Is that a bird over there? Let's see, I should try using the binoculars. Can I study? Okay, so you can study it, and you can see, so I can see that that's only two stars. So if I want a perfect turkey, that's not my turkey. I love it. All right, anyways, keep going. Use the varmint rifle for bunnies, okay. Gotta remember what is what. There goes the sun. Maybe I should set up camp for the night. It's been a while, but... Nah. Arthur Morgan doesn't need sleep. Some of these animal screeches. Like, what the heck? Yeah, two stars, good. Okay. That's nice that you can tell the quality beforehand, though. And back through here, let's get our trinket. With the lion's paw. See what that does. Hello again. Hello, hello. Um, let's see, is it bye? So old Bob Crawford was livid about his coach getting robbed. I was very sympathetic. We'll get one more. Canned peas? Lock breaker. Ooh. Used to silently break locks? That's something I should buy. We have the money. Metal skull mask. Psycho mask. Special bitters pamphlet. So these are all crafting things. I feel like the horse medicine and stuff, that, that might be useful later. That's not it. It looks like it's going to be a craft situation. Lion's Paw Trinket. Here we go. Permanently increases the player's stamina experience bonus. That's cool. Did we get anything else yet? Nope. Looks like we need to bring the legendary things here, though. Cool. So I'm assuming I need to equip that trinket back in camp? Arthur Morgan or John Marston? That's tough to say, because I like uh, I like John Marston a lot in the first game. But in this game, you do get a little bit of a different perspective on John. You definitely do. Uh-oh, where did Albert Mason go? Wasn't he supposed to be down here? I'm going to start heading down this way and see if we can go find Albert. See if I show up a little bit closer, it might show up on the map. Yeah. Wait, if we just go over there. Also, maybe because it's nighttime. That's probably it. We'll find somewhere to camp. Probably up here. So, I don't know. I like Arthur Morgan a lot. It's taken some time to get to know him, though. But that's part of his whole thing. There's a trinket that increases the chance of getting a perfect pelt. 
That's nice. They don't make it that easy. They really don't. All right, I'm gonna pull off to the side here and... Wait, where is camp? Here we go. I can access basic crafting without a fire by selecting crafting tools from item wheel. Okay. And I can fast travel from here now. I didn't realize I could fast travel from a camp. Oh, I did not realize that. That's cool. Okay, well, let's sleep till morning. Set up tent? Sure. Oh, you can set up the whole tent? That's fun. Let's hope we don't get woken up by the train. We definitely will. Morning. Till morning. Hey, Geo, welcome back. Marston doesn't have that cool factor that he had in the first one. No, no, you know too much about him now. <laughs> Is there an upcoming RPG that I'm looking forward to? Hey, Cyber, that's a great question. Um, okay, first, let me look at my map. Trying to think of what is going to be coming out next. No, I think I kind of need to just run down there. Let's go. What is coming out next? I'm trying to think of what I'm looking forward to later this year. There's definitely some games. Um, I just kind of don't know the timeline for a lot of releases. Like, I know that there's a lot of games, like, coming up. Like, you know, like, what about, like, the new Mass Effect game? Like, oh, wait, 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 wait. I need to tear down my camp. I need to tear down my camp. Hang on. Can't leave it here. There we go. Um, oh, Starfield. Yes. Starfield's the big one. But Starfield's not released this year anymore. Starfield's next year now. Um, so we do have to wait just a tad bit longer than we originally thought, which is fine. We just have to be patient. Their Harry Potter Hogwarts game seems interesting. It definitely does. Invest in a PlayStation and grab God of War. I do want to play the God of War games. I do want to invest in a PlayStation at some point. Um... I think the, the PC upgrade is gonna happen first for oh, sure, hell, but showed up. Hello. What you looking at? March along. <laughs> what you doing? Didn't mean to interrupt. Last what? chance to walk. What are you guys doing? Yeah, that's why I thought. What are you doing? Okay. But if there ain't no convoy coming through. Alright. Wait. Go for it. Wait. Wait, go for it. Go for what? What are they doing? I don't know what they're doing. Shooting? Shooting, Shooting what? We got some work to do. We're gonna make you a killer, boy. Let me try another one. Gonna make you a killer? Are they just right. teaching this guy to shoot? Go ahead. Shooting. The animal on your horse is starting to decompose and lose value. Already? Oops. Okay, well, I think they're just shooting things, so I'm gonna just leave them alone. <laughs> God of War is on PC. Yeah, the first one, right? I don't have that one on PC yet, no. I've got it on my wish list, I think, so I'm gonna keep an eye out for next time that goes on sale. Same with Sekiro. Both of those I've got my eye on. Um, I've also, I would also like to play The Witcher 3. I know that that's not a new game, but I would like to play through that. Mmm. What else is supposed to be coming out? A lot of things have gotten delayed, so I don't know what's coming out really soon. You know? Shauna, hello and welcome. GTA or Red Dead? Definitely Red Dead. I haven't actually played that much GTA. Hi, James. Welcome. How's it going? Oh, the new Pokemon games. Those will be fun. Have I, have I been over here? I think I've been to this town, right? Yeah, this is where I, uh... Stay out. Yep. This is where I wrote down in my journal I found this town. There, girl. Wait, what was... What was over there? Was there a predator? Yeah. Well, what's in? Is there a predator over here? Oh, there's a snake. Wait, I shouldn't have used that rifle. Dang it, I didn't think. I didn't think before I shot. 
that's that's a hunting thing and i'm sure it's not going to be a very good well it doesn't seem like it has the quality for a rattlesnake apparently does not have a quality never mind does not matter they are always so graphic with the skinning of the animals okay yeah no it's one star it's one star oops oopsie Did I lose the rabbit? Looks like I lost the rabbit. That's okay. Okay, girl. Yep. You'd love to see God of War. Me too. Me too. So maybe we can put that on the list of games to play. Okay, so we got God of War. Well, I've got to start writing all these down. God of War, Sekiro, Witcher, those are probably like the top three like next games to play. Maybe another playthrough of Elden Ring at some point. Did I ever finish Breath of the Wild? No, I haven't finished Breath of the Wild. I've gotten really close to finishing it. I have one Divine Beast left on my playthrough that I've been at for like three years. Uh, on and off. I haven't touched Zelda in a while. And Horizon Zero Dawn. Yes, I actually have that game. Oh wait. I'm not even heading directly towards the quest marker. There we go. Nope, that still didn't. There we go. Yep. Did I upgrade my satchels? Nope, I am searching for those pelts to upgrade them. Old Jack or young Jack? Oh, John Marston's son? I don't know, he's a cool character either way. Ooh. Easy now. Ooh, there's a crocodile. Does the Springfield rifle work? Let's see, I can study it. Oh, it's only one star to start with. I could try to find a better quality alligator. I guess I might as well, right? Whoa. Let's take a look. Nope, I want, I want the binoculars. That's a three star, that's a perfect one. Use a bow with improved arrows or a long scope rifle. Okay, a bow with improved arrows, let's see. Do I have that? No, I don't. Or a long scope rifle. My long scope was my this one that's the long scope right the rolling block rifle will this work to take out this perfect alligator does that count as a long scope rifle i'm assuming this does maybe high velocity just to, to make sure i think this works Thank you for making a list, Uncle Peaches. Um, anything else you should add? I think that's good for now. Oh, there's a water snake. Okay, I think this is good now. Do I just shoot it right in the face? Yes, we find out. Yes, we find out. Wait, where? Easy, whoa. Did it just disappear? Did it just disappear? What happened to it? It just... I shot it! You think the three stargator was in the water? Was it? But like, wait... I shot something! Dang it! Yep. So ah. now. I think it despawned. Like, do you see it on the mini map? I don't see anything on the mini map, so I guess it just is gone. What the heck? All of the alligators seem to have despawned. Yeah. It must have something to do with this quest. It must. <laughs> oh, can my horse swim, or are we just running through deep water? Yes, we're running through it. Must it must be uh, 
with the quest. That's really unfortunate. Well, we'll try again in a minute. Hey, Albert, what's up? They creep up on you, you know. Huh? <laughs> yeah, Morgan. it definitely despawned because right. of this well, quest. Sir. What are you Dang. working on? Do you know anything about alligators? Only the basics. Avoid them wherever possible. <laughs> well, did you know that in the last 50 years, we've killed 90%? You say that like it makes you sad. They're beautiful yeah, creatures. Yeah, a lot of them. Fallen Angel, Let's thank you so much for the 100 one bits. Got you in a I appreciate the support. Yes, I will make some creature a very happy lunch one of these days. Let's try and avoid that from happening thank today. You. Hmm? Well, you stay there, you'll get a great shot. Then you'll get eaten. What a way to go. What a way to go. Why don't we take this boat out? And I'll protect you. Come on. It's like, that would be exciting. Get the boat, he'll be fine. Oh. The last moments would be really real crazy. You carry on shooting from that bank, you're going to wish them wolves had eaten you. Really? Yes. The 10% who survived, they're the nasty ones. Fair enough. All right, we're rowing. Um, oh, oh. So Is he gonna sing me any songs? All into the west. Hope so. All into the northwest. There. That, that's probably where we should look. Let's go look then. When we find one, line me up so I can get the shot. I'll try. All right. Dang close. it! It despawned all the alligators for this. Close, but not too close. Got it. Probably not a good place to swim. True. They brought alligators won't venture far from the weeds near the shoreline. If we're in luck, an alligator won't be far away. Saving alligators, but you don't mind that pork chop getting butchered. Pork chop isn't in danger of extinction. <laughs> don't know if I can actually use anything here. No. Oh. It's Gator. Quick, quick. I must get this shot. Oh, I God's piggy! On, Can we get the angle right? No, turn, piggy! Turn. You see something I don't? Oh, turn! Why stop. Oh. Uh, not quite there. Turn. Oh, I didn't realize he was talking to me. There we go. Oops. Okay. So um. Oopsies. Now okay, now I got southwest it. Southwest or due west? You know, in the season, there are more alligator hunters down here than than alligators. Maybe you can take a photograph of one of them, then. <laughs> Very droll. There was even a tour company that let excursionists shoot from the deck of a paddle steamer. Oh, my God. Plugged up the waterways and turned whole bayous into mud. Thankfully, the state legislator put a stop to it. A paddle steamer, huh? Now, why didn't we think of that? Well, there's another right. one. Right. There, in the cane break. That's a likely spot for one. Take us around the island until we see something. Okay. Okay, there. we're real close. You see its head? Uh. Hooking up there. Line us up to it. You point. I'll shoot, old boy. Come on. Uh. Is that close enough for you? Just in repose. All as calm as the predator lurks. The final sighting was to the northwest of here. All right, we keep going. Feet, Nineteen feet. Twenty-one feet with a five-foot head. Can I go through here? Lots of big bulls in these parts. Don't know if I can go through here, but we're gonna try. Gators here, and us two idiots are sitting in a twelve-foot skip. No, this was in the seventies, eighties. All the really big gators have been hunted out and killed. Uh oh. More the shame, I say. Uh oh. We're making it through. Shame to this rolling fool who values his arms being attached to his body. Can you imagine the smell of this place? Especially with the big ones. I like Albert too. No, he's gone. Can you stop the boat just there, off the island? Sure. If we stop too long, locals are gonna start getting curious. Just, just there, please. So, so I'm facing the landmass. Now look, there's an alligator back in those palms. Could you, could you run in there and coax him out? Run, coax run him. in? Please, he's quite something. If I could take that fellow's likeness, it might, it might just save him from the taxidermist. Fine. Hmm. Rotate it to face quest. Okay, yep, this That's way. The there he is. Can, can you rotate us a little? Maybe I want this monster stuffed in on this Approach boat. it? Oh, oh, goodness. That's the spirit. 
Out you go then. Get him and uh, get him to notice. Go, Arthur, go. I don't like this. Let's see, should I lasso him? Not one bit. Can I lasso him? That'll get his attention, right? Oh, I can't lasso the alligator. Well, he's awake. Run! I hope you're slow. No, 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 no. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, how do I get in the boat? How do I get in? I really don't. There we go. <laughs> we can congratulate ourselves on a job well done, Mr. Morgan. Take us back where we began. Anyway, All right. I hope you got something worth printing. Hope so. Oh, he did give us cool wolf we'll pictures. These beautiful beasts for what they are. Killing machines? <laughs> no. Oh, well, yes. Well, maybe yes. Yeah. Maybe that's not a bad thing. This is America, after all. We hold a love for killers that borders on macabre. <laughs> Loving killers is part of our makeup. <laughs> maybe. America. Maybe. But usually we wait until after they're dead. Well, I hope we've changed. Me too. Oop. That away. We're oh, sorry. I didn't killers. mean to. I pressed the wrong button. My bad. My bad. The fact that we can relive those years so accurately through games shows what a masterpiece Rockstar created. It is pretty, pretty cool. It feels very immersive. And I, I love the fashion in it. I need to go shopping. I was I was looking today. I'm like, do I have anything that can come up with a cosplay in my oh, wardrobe? Yes. I'm like, no, not, not really. Just pull up to the bank. I gotta go, gotta go do some shopping. That should do it. Yes. These pictures you're Maybe thrift stores yes. would have good things. They're gonna be any good. I certainly hope so. Though I doubt it. The subject is magnificent. The backdrop, jaw-dropping. But the agent of beauty is a talentless fool. Although maybe I'll strike a few lucky shots. You sure do make me laugh that way you talk about yourself, Mr. Mason. Well, I'm good for laughing at, if nothing else. I don't Aww. mean it like that. I know. Still, I feel such a fool around you, sir. Don't worry about it. Oh. Good luck I out there. I many an ignominious future for myself, but okay, let's see if we can actually get our in distress. Well, uh, <laughs> get ourselves an alligator. Good luck, Mr. Mason. Thank you, and to you too, sir. Try and stay out of trouble. I shall certainly try. Best of luck. All right. Wait, he's got a water snake. A water snake. Wait, nope, nope. Get out of here. Oh, I tried. He's running over the water snake. Oh, there they go. It won't let me lock on. Let's see, I can study the snake. I can study it. Midland water snake. Oh, wait, nope, nope, nope. Can I, can I take the snake? Oh, it only... Dang it. Wait, wait, wait. Is that an alligator right here? That sounds like an alligator. Wait, 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 wait. Get me out of here, get me out of here, get me out of here. We need to go, we need to go, we need to go, we need to go. Alright, girl. Easy. Was that an alligator? I am not sure. Okay, that did not go how I planned. Okay. I don't think I'm... Okay. So, there's a bunch of crocodiles. There's a bunch of them. Okay. That one... That one... Has... Three stars. Okay, let's see, we need this rifle. Right in the face. Okay, let's see if that worked. Where is it? Where did it go? Is it gone? 
Okay, there it goes. Skin. We're skinning it underwater. There we go. Perfect alligator skin. Nice. Let's see, who's the best one to give this to? Would it be the trapper? Or maybe camp? I kind of wish I knew what should go where. Let's see, because the trapper is way up there. I might just bring this one back to camp. But, you think the trapper? Because I'm not really sure what who needs what, and different ones need different perfect pelts and stuff. Okay, where's another trapper? Is there a different trapper anywhere over here? Technically. Mm, don't know what's closer. Probably the one back up this way. It does take me in a new area. Maybe I go check that out. Animals dead or alive will lose stars if you hit them with your horse or if you run on their body. Okay, that does make sense. Alright, let's get out of here. To the trapper we go. Sorry, I didn't mean to turn this into a hunting stream, but it, it's been... I don't know, it's kind of fun. Like the poor animals, but also it does turn it into a game. We gotta find, gotta find the perfect ones. Everything else, you know, they get to live. Some cranes. I don't think we need new feathers though. Yep. All right, yeah, zoom zoom. A girl. Go south. There's a city with a trapper in it. Like down there. This way? I haven't been that way yet. We could try, but I don't know how long it'll take before it shows up on the map. Can't remember how many alligators were needed. It wasn't a lot. Okay, that's good. We'll have to go back, though. Yes, go down? Yeah? I mean, we could go down that way. St. Denise down that way? Hmm... Well, I kind of want to know what's up here, though, now. I kind of want to know what's this way. Idiot. That's okay. We'll go to St. Denis when it... Soon. Or should I just go down there? Maybe I should. Let me see. Let me just take a look. Where are we at? I just don't know where ex where I'm going exactly. But I guess we can head down this way. It's, it's more towards the direction of, of where we're trying to go. So, sure. Let's try. Let's see if we can find a trapper yep. this way. Welcome on into the witch's lair. How's it going? Alright, we'll keep running through the swamps. I'm gonna probably not hunt anymore until we get to a trapper, because I don't know how much we can carry. See the birds. I don't think I need to hunt the birds. Birds are cool. They mostly give us feathers, and I think we have enough feathers. What's going on? state for the federal Stay government. Back. You're an enemy of this state. Hey! What's going on? Why don't you get away? I ain't shoot kidding. someone that can shoot back. Oh, good. Please oh, God. geez, that's the wrong. Wrong. Ah. I'm a there we go. Thank you, stranger. These raiders are insane. Yeah, you're welcome. Are you, are you just running? You're just out of here? Okay, well. Goodbye. Nope, that's not. I didn't mean to do that. Get out of here. For more of show up. Okay, let's go in front of that train and be on our way. Happy we helped someone. Hmm. Okay, what's down here? So we're coming up on something. I still might want to go back up this way because I just, I don't know what that is. And something. Let's see. Hello, everyone. 
good day to you. Why don't you watch where you're going? Why don't you watch where you're going, even though that was my fault. So it's cool. So I like how this game kind of slowly introduces you to new areas, but it is fully open world. So you can go places already. There's a restaurant. Maybe we'll get some food ideas there for our cooking stream tomorrow. I think I'm going to make some lobster bisque, by the way. So that's that's here on Twitch tomorrow. Oh, 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 who's going first? I'm going first. Okay, so I'm in the town. Let's take a look at the town. There's a stranger quest. But I want to find the trapper. That's what we're here for. So I don't want to explore too much in this town yet until it has me come here because I know that this is the big main town. I do remember this town from Red Dead 1. It seems to be a lot bigger, I'm pretty sure, than it was in Red Dead 1. Gotta love the false alarm gun draws, right? Gotta pe keep everyone on their toes. Like, will I shoot you? Won't I shoot you? I'm just kidding. This is a big city. Ooh, we lagged a bit, but that's okay. This is a big city. Are those hitchin posts? Yes. Uh, hola, senor. It's good, girl. Hello, okay, yeah. um, can my horse stay tied up here? We're gonna see if that works. Hello, mister, I move it. Oh, move it, I guess. Again, Ooh, here we go. Hello. Okay, let's take a look Is my it. horse close enough? Yes, that's nice. Okay, poor deer pelt, poor snake carcass, and the perfect alligator skin. That's what we like to see. But sure, venison meat. Yeah, we're gonna get rid of that. We do not need more venison. At this point, I, we don't need more food. Can be sold. I hope you make something pretty with that. All right, I think we're good. Hello there. All right, let's keep moving. I don't know if I fully want to explore this whole area yet. I think I think we come back. Okay, oh, look at that! That's fun. Why would they put that right there? Why would they put a hitching post where it can hit my horse if it's tied up? Where, what? Modern technology? Unsafe. Unsafe. Ooh, wait, that's a tailor? That's fun. I wanna check that out on my way through here. On my way out of this town. Hello. No, that's Blackwater. This town isn't in Red Dead One. It's not? Why does it sound familiar? Hey Star Wars, good to see ya. Hello, Miss. How is everything with you? This is the new city. Okay, that's why it looks so different. Got it. I've just heard of it before. I must have just heard it online. This is pretty. I like the tree tunnel. Oh wait, there's the tailor. There's a stop sign? That's crazy. Where am I supposed to leave my horse? Here's a hitching post, but the thing is, it's still kind of in the street. But if anyone hits my horse, I'm suing the city. It's the city's fault. It's it's their fault. Definitely inspired by New Orleans. Oh, cool. What, French Quarter? I have not been to New Orleans, but I'd love to go. Let's see what the deal is at the tailor. Also, we need to get uh, his hat back. You're making a Ooh. scene, you know. I'm, I'm not trying to make a scene. I'm sorry. Hello. This, this is your favorite town. It's cool looking. Monsieur? Out of the way. Move. Hey, watch out. How do I get inside? Oh, I don't think I can get in here. Yeah, I don't think it really wants me in the city yet. Let's keep moving. 
even know if I want to do the, the side quest that's here yet. I think I would like to go back to Dutch for now. Hello, sir. Hello. Hi there, mister. Go on. Hey there, mister. They're like, slow down. Leave my horse on the streetcar tracks. No. It doesn't even matter if I leave my horse on the streetcar tracks. I guess they're going to come hit me anyways. How do you do, sir? Hello, how do you do? I'm running. Excuse me. Another day on the move. That was quite a big town. I'm impressed. Hold on there. A minute of your time. Who are you? Let's get us a closer look at this one here. Hey there. Around here, strangers got a cough up pavement. Oh, yeah? Get down for despite what you seem to think, I ain't one for charity. Oh, dang. They just. Oh wait, nope, we're not done. Ooh, we're off our horse. My horse got spooked! Fools. Yes, fools. So, question. So if I loot their bodies, does that that does that take honor down? Even though they attacked me? They're not, that, that was just like a regular oh, shakedown. That wasn't like the Adriscals, so I feel like that might give me a bounty. Can I take that wagon back to a wagon fence? Maybe I can. It's all right, we'll keep going. No, no it doesn't? Okay, let's test that theory. Look at the pretty rainbow in the mist. Let's take their stuff. They won't be needing it anymore. Inspect a document. Document. What did we just get? A reward letter? Letters? Raiders letter. William, I am writing to let you know our raids against the Jayhawkers in Lawrence, Kansas have been successful. There are many times since we set out on this campaign that I doubted that there was a god who loved us, but today I have a glimmer of hope. That they call us Lemoyne Raiders, Bushwhackers, and Border Ruffians does not diminish our fight for a free state and to be free from the incursions of Northerners set on changing our way of life. I hope you will continue to work to recruit more young men to our cause here in Lemoyne. We will ride through their ranks and smite down the oppressors. History is not over and shall be rewritten. It is always darkest before dawn. Sincerely, William Marcus Anderson. Interesting. Loot everyone you can. If it brings, pings your honor down, it's pretty easy to raise back up. I mean, fair enough. I'm not that concerned about it. I was just trying. What? Why are you saying? What? Why are you cursing? Nothing even happened. Goodness. Welcome on into the witch's lair. How's it going tonight? <laughs> This way we go. Looks like there's another crocodile over there. Up. Let's take a look with our binoculars. It does make our binoculars quite useful. Mm. There's the other alligator. That's an alligator way back there. That's a perfect one. That's way over there though. It's okay. Well, it is a perfect alligator. Maybe I should go get it. It's just right there. Let's see. Let's take a closer look. Oop, 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 slow down. Yep, that's it. So we're gonna take our Springfield rifle. Nope, that's not it. 
Whoopsies. Rolling block rifle. That was it with the long scope. And that should give me the perfect health. Why is my horse running? Why? Nothing's happening. The pelts don't degrade though, right? Here we get to see the whole graphic thing. It's not underwater this time. Oh my, he really does a whole thing. Did I just get called the Jughead? What? I'm just skinning an alligator, minding my business. I suggest you mind yours. <laughs> Horses hate alligators and snakes. Okay, fair enough. I mean, that makes sense. What a good jumper. Yeah. Broomstick is really amazing. Been literally the perfect horse. Pelts don't degrade, but the large ones can fall off your horse. It's good to know. I'll try not to lose it. Hey, mister. Hello. Alright, let's go back to Dutch. Maybe pick one more mission to do tonight. Because I know last night, some of these missions can be pretty long. Last night I was like, oh, it's midnight. Yeah, we'll do some more things. And then next thing I look over, it's 1.30. I'm like, what? Didn't... Did, I... Five minutes just passed, right? No? Okay. Help me. What do you need? Do you need... Is something chasing you? Help. You okay, mister? Why? <laughs> what? Please. I've been bitten by a snake. Oh, snake bite? <laughs> I need medicine. Medicine? <laughs> All right, I here's the health gear. This has happened once before, and it paid off for us. The guy bought us a weapon. Oh, 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 thank you. How many of those health cures do I have left? Health tonic? Potent health cure. Yeah, we got enough. Thank you. Oh, I should maybe eat some food. Some beans? Sure, have some beans. Oh, oh. oh you won, mister. Got that right. Got that right. Someday. Well, best of luck. Now, I gotta get out of here. Yep, congrats on not dying. Yeah, I would assume not. Just stay the hell away from snakes, all right? <laughs> Goodbye. Good luck. Yep. Suck it out, it's funny. <laughs> Does it do a whole animation? I'll have to try it next time. I haven't done that. I normally just give him the medicine. Beautiful rainy day. This makes me miss rainy days. Are we... What? I... Oh no! Oh no! A collision! I'm sorry! I'm sorry! I... No! Oh no! My poor horse! Have a carrot! I'm sorry! I was just reading that Dutch has asked me to not cause trouble in this area, and then what do I go do but cause trouble? Oh no. Is this another fence? I don't know if I need a fence. I think we're good. Well, maybe we do need a fence though, cause, cause it, can I sell the fence, the alligator pelt? Hang on, let me take a look. I did cause trouble. I did indeed. Hello, sir. Glad to have a new patron come through. Hello. So yeah, this is all legendary animal stuff. Legendary bear claw, silver chain bracelet. Okay, so maybe I should keep some of these random things. 
Abalone shell earring. Yeah, silver earring. So I need to make sure I keep some stuff like that. Okay, so no, this is not the place to bring this. Welcome, mister. First time to my shop. Um, anything else I can sell? Sure. Let me Before see. Before I go. Just take it Mm, not really. Ain't nothing you can do. Thanks, partner. Okay, girl. All right, here we go. I did cause an 1889 traffic jam. Uh oh, you're lucky. Usually, when that happens, they try and kill you. Yeah, I was kind of surprised that they just ran away, but they didn't cause trouble. They knew not to mess with me. All right, we're back in the roads here. Oh, come on in. Oh wait, that's that's a hitching post right here. You want money? I'm busy. Sometimes it does seem like they're trying to run into you, right? Okay, hopefully the alligator skin just stays on. I don't know if I want to start a whole thing with Dutch. With the alligator skin still there. Um... It's fine. Give a dollar? Sure, you can have a dollar. Sure. Well, thank you. Some honor? No. Say, say where you from? Around. <laughs> Ain't from right here. If that was you, I'd leave. This town lost its goddamn soul a long time ago. <laughs> Nothing but nasty, miserable people. Like yeah? Yeah, yeah, ever since them, them greys moved here. They're a bunch of no-good white trash. Yeah, they, they somehow got rich. About 50 years ago, they moved here, caused a whole heap of trouble. Yeah, I reckon they was, reckon they was Yankee spies during the war and everything. That's so. Yeah, sure. Interesting. You think hey, y'all. Hello. Hey, hello. There. Hey there, partner. Gotta say hi to everyone. Yeah. Mister. Hello. You know a good place, get some food. Hell of fine now. You seem full of joys of spring, miss. Newspaper? Thanks. Hello, sir. Hi. Let's grab a newspaper. Shall we read it? Don't wanna buy something? Very interesting last time. Um, oh, it looks like we've got two of them. Have fun reading. We're a little behind. Line up, bro. Okay, number 44. So Get let's let's catch up on our newspaper here. Train robbery confounds lawmen. Wagon blocked train, officials call for action. Gertrude Bambach was knitting a hat for her niece when the train lurched to a stop and shouting commenced. I feared for my life, she said. Passengers well, were subjected to a terrifying ordeal as the train was robbed near the Lemoyne border. Outlaws right used an oil wagon on the train on the tracks to cause the train to come to a stop. They then threatened the passengers to give up their belongings. It was then that the lawmen, having been tipped off to the robbery, arrived on the scene and confronted the outlaws. So they were tipped off. Sheriff Tompkins was one of those lawmen who arrived on the scene. There is very little to tell. We are searching for evidence at this time. The passengers are in great distress. The supply cars have been looted. Men are dead. This region's problems with lawlessness have returned. Reports indicate the outlaws escaped after having engaged in a furious gun battle with the lawmen. Let's see, President congratulates America, says U.S. is unstoppable. Spanish-American war bro. outcome celebrated, victory in 100 days. President Alfred McAllister congratula congratulated the American people and their response to the call to arms as North and South joined together, joined together to defeat Spain, saying that Spain is no longer a power and that the United States stands as the strongest nation in the Western Hemisphere. The splendid little war saw the U.S. Navy defeat the Spanish fleet in a mere few hours. Not one American life was lost in that skirmish, proving what McAllister says is a testament to the glory and perseverance of America. Overall, only 300 Americans lost their lives in the war, while the other side reported thousands of dead at the hands of our brave boys. He especially made mention of Her Colonel Thaddeus Waxman and his Rough Riders, the cavalry troop that took San Juan Hill in Guarma, becoming a national hero in the process. That did happen, right? The Rough Riders in San Juan Hill? That was a thing. Evidence of ancient mystery discovered. Local man finds rock carvings. Some good news. Um, let's see. If you save the game, if you save it when you reload, it'll still be on the horse. Ooh, good call. Ministers... 
Ministers gathered last week to denounce the claims of eccentric resident Frank Sinclair of Big Valley, West Elizabeth, who asserts he has found evidence of ancient peoples in local rock formations. He has discovered several mysterious rock carvings around the country and claim they point to a great meaning, a mystery he intends to solve. Religious leaders have grown concerned with his work, worrying that others will get caught up in his fervor and heretical beliefs. There is only one meaning and message, and that is the good book, Reverend Sterling Wharton stated during the gathering. Grizzlies under siege, okay. The most desperate bandits in the region are imposing a reign of terror on the grizzlies and surrounding country. Flaco Hernandez, famous glenslinger. They've raided no numerous local towns, including Strawberry and Valentine. Okay, let's see. Murdered on the loose. Up, Murderer on papers. the loose. Was headed to prison. Ambush freeze outlaw. Member of Vanderlyn gang. Hot chase for fugitives. Uh-oh. Is this, is this Micah? Oh, no, this was for Sean. That's right. Thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. I'm assuming Micah will be in the next, next, um, edition. Sean McGuire, a member of the notorious Dutch Vanderlyn's gang, has escaped from custody. McGuire was captured and in the process of being transported from Blackwater to a federal prison in the West. He is part of Vanderlyn's gang, who were responsible for the recent Blackwater boat robbery that left many dead. The shootout was fierce, and several men were killed as a result. Bounty hunters had caught McGuire, but were ambushed on a stretch of the upper, upper Montana River by Confederates of the accused. Upon relating the circumstances of the escape, one lawman on the scene said that McGuire repeatedly expressed the idea of jail as no terror to him, nor the idea of death by a hangman's noose. McGuire even once suggested to a sheriff that his rope wasn't stout enough and may break Line under up, his bro. weight. Officials have called for action, saying the escape is yet another example of the inability of police to keep criminals incarcerated. Oh, and Cornwall. Cornwall expansion continues. We know Cornwall. Try to spend some time in camp between missions. That's a good idea. I probably should go back to camp after this, right? I don't know if I want to immediately up, start the whole thing with Dutch. Papers. I could. We'll see. Leviticus Cornwall is a well-known expansionist. A railroad into every expanse of this country is only a matter of time, he declared when launching a Cornwall Southern and Eastern Railways. He builds the trains and uses them to ship goods for Cornwall freight and commodities, Cornwall kerosene Line and tar, up, and his paper. other business concerns. His sugar business reaches into the Caribbean, and not a week goes by without a ship ferrying Cornwall sugar calling into America. He is now calling for government support to bring protection to industries working to improve conditions in the West after a string of robberies. Mr. Cornwall, who has been known to speak glibly Line about up, the road, evil effects of education upon certain kinds of lesser intellects, is one of the wealthiest men in the region and requires numerous private guards to protect his person and multiple concerns. Sounds like he does have some concerns. Despite questionable accounts of poor conditions at plantations run by Cornwall employees, his goods flow throughout much of the United States, and Congress has so far shown little appetite for breaking up what many people call a regional monopoly of services. Alongside his private militia, he is believed to be one of the principal clients of the Pinkerton Agency in the region. Oh, the, the plot thickens. Line up, roads, Cigarette cards papers. give fame to murderers. Oh no, they're protesting. That the cards honor gunslingers such as Black Bell, Jim Boy Calloway, and even Emmett Granger, a known sadistic killer who has in recent years turned to... What? Turned to... Turned to... Turned to... What? Anyways, next article. <laughs> Scarlet... What? Uh... Let's see. Oh, Scarlet Fever? That's, that's a disease, right? It's exists in this town to an extent that has never been seen before, believed to be due to bad sanitation. Uh-oh. Though one health official claims it's exacerbated by the high winds and dust Line storms up, plaguing road. the country. Yeah, I'm sure. Okay, well, sanitary conditions in the town are deplorable, and the mortality rate is so high that residents have taken to burning bodies. Yikes. Have a great rest of the stream. Must be off. Have a good one, Los Hunter. Thanks for joining us tonight. We won't be going too much longer anyways. Oh, it's already one. Holy moly. Line up, Rose. Let's Get see. Your Immigrants must stay out. Exclusion act upheld. Great. Goodness. Foreign workers harmful to wages and the economy. Goodness. 
What else? Machine kills man, first death by petrol driven vehicle. Mr. and Mrs. Thomas Eberhardt were heading from Boston to San Francisco by vehicle Thursday and met a terrible accident as hundreds waited hours in the street for their arrival in Stamford, Connecticut to see an automobile for the first time. This couple was taking a much celebrated drive across the United States, seldom accomplished as onlookers in each town stopped to see a horseless carriage with their Paper very own dead. eyes. Right According here. to officials, the roads have been in a terrible state since the rains and the wheel and its spokes abruptly shattered, causing the autom automobile to fly into a ravine, flinging Mr. Eberhardt out and in front of the vehicle and breaking his neck. Yikes. Seatbelts, folks. Sorrow and the South, One migration is beginning. Let's see. Okay. We're saying to watch out for migration. Oh my gosh. They're very afraid of anyone. A tale of two robberies. Highwaymen clash at coach holdup. Two separate bands of highwaymen had their sights on the same banking stagecoach. Driver called out, it's a holdup. Come on, come Let's on. Let's see. Yeah, the Adriscoll boys. It. So more Adriscoll. Albright captured. Oh, we caught this guy. This was our bounty. When Fanny Crenshaw suffered from rheumatism, she looked to Benedict Albright to ease her suffering. This is the guy we had the whole cutscene with and the, the bounty. He told her that the fatty streak of flesh around the vertebrae of reptiles will cure any case extra, of rheumatic extra. issue. Showing her it. a long list of certificates from happy patients he had cured, she borrowed money from the bank and purchased several bottles. Miss Crenshaw is now one of many people who have been poisoned by Albright's so-called miracle cures. Tales have poured in after each town he visited, with purchasers feeling sickly and usually far worse than their original condition they sought to cure. Extra, extra. Albright was finally All captured and brought into the office paper. of Valentine's Sheriff by a bounty hunter who's rumored to be a family member or friend of someone poisoned by Albright's hideous concoctions. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Lord of Angling. So they're talking about catfish... You can go catch some fantastic bullhead catfish. All right, and that's, that's that. It is super cool how much detail is put into these newspapers. Oh, I love it. I really like these. Okay, wait. Now we got to catch up on the next one. <clears throat> Blood in the streets of Valentine. A horror show. Dead everywhere. Families grieving. Dutch's gang. Coroner overwhelmed. Valentine. Residents say it sounded like the Indian Wars had resumed on their streets. At first, shots rang out as women and the feeble ran for cover. It soon turned into an unrelenting cacophony of gunfire. Lawmen traded shots with members of the notorious Vanderlyn gang, who had come to town to rob and steal. A few agents known to be working for Leviticus Cornwall jo joined in the fray, quickly creating a scene of unmitigated, unmitigated chaos. Valentine is well known in the, in the region as a rough around the edges livestock town with some insalubrious visitors and altercations are not uncommon. The recent spate of violence is, however, unprecedented. Bar fights in the Smithfield Saloon are too frequent. Many are still in shock at the recent violence, including a brutal massacre at Six Point Cabin. Local officials are calling on state and federal authorities for assistance in restoring order. Lemoyne Raiders turned Free Staters, quest for independence. Yeah, so these are these, uh, ra the Raiders who are, you know, initially looked upon as patriotic heroes fighting against tyranny during that conflict. They have failed to let the war between states pass hit to history, instead using it as a rally point to wage war on law-abiding citizens. And some say they have become the tyranny themselves. Um, de they declare that they are immune from tax and other regulation. Hmm. Pneumatic Wonder. Inventor patents motorized carpet sweeper. What? Bulky hand crank carpet sweepers may soon be relics when Thomas Rivington's invention becomes available. While in his study one afternoon, he overheard his wife and mother-in-law lament so on the hardships of cleaning floors by working bellows on a carpet sweeper device. He came upon an idea and so. began tinkering. Uh -huh. The result is his pneumatic carpet renovator, which creates a vacuum-like suction that pulls dust into a receptacle. Wow, the beginning of the vacuum. Amazing. Alchemist claims gold created from tin. Hmm. No. 
If such a discovery were announced, the gold markets would surely collapse. <laughs> oh! Emeralds? We have an emerald. We have an emerald. Wait, this is about an emerald. Treasure hunter disappears. Was seeking famed emerald from Guarma. Family fears the worst. Treasure hunter and gemolis gemologist Louis T. Aberson has amassed a collection of gems from around the world and is particularly fond of emeralds, having given his betrothed an emerald engagement ring from a stone he procured from Egypt to match her green eyes. Six months ago, he bid farewell to his wife and newborn daughter and headed on a frigate to the island Guarma in the Spanish West Indies near Cuba in search of what has been rumored to be the largest emerald ever discovered. His wife, Mrs. Henrietta Aberson, reports that she received one or two letters brimming with excitement as Lewis claimed to be closer to finding the object of his quarry. Then communication ceased, and weeks passed without a letter or cable. She fears the worst and has asked parishioners at her local church and treasure hunters everywhere to pray daily for his safe return. I wonder if that's relevant. Did the circus people take the emerald? Let's see, royal kidnap? Oh. Let's see, Luxembourg. In a royal proclamation, the Grand Duchy of Luxembourg has issued a decree offering a reward of $1,000 for information resulting in the whereabouts of Princess Isabeau. The princess disappeared from a remote hunting lodge while on a hunting trip during a private family visit to the United States. She was five years old at the time. Oh, geez. I wonder if we can find her. I hope so. <clears throat> well, come on in. If only I had an emerald, right? I guess we're gonna have to go find someone. Okay, woman suffrage debate. Movement grows. Yes, voting rights. States in the north have passed laws allowing women suffrage to their detriment and arguably to their damnation. Oh. We cannot allow, allow the scourge of the north and Europe to spread here. Women are evidently weaker sex and unable to think things out coolly and calmly. Hmm. 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 Kidnappers at large. Lawmen on the hunt. Um, a statewide manhunt is underway in Lemoyne for the Anderson Boys, the brutal and bloodthirsty gang who have taken to kidnapping and ransoming locals. Led by Anders Anderson, the outlaws are responsible for a spate of violent attacks and kidnapping in the region. Okay, and then a tightrope walker? Tightrope daredevil Bessie Adair is preparing for her greatest feat yet, walking across the Pikes Basin in New Austin. Known for her death-defying feats in the St. Denis Circus, she has spent the past weeks meticulously training for her bold attempt. Adair plans a grand event next month to celebrate the tightrope walk with a precise date to be determined. A flying machine crashes? Oh my gosh, a steam-powered steam flying machine to be used for war purposes. The Aerodrome. He was given $25,000 for the project? That's a lot back then, dang. President's acts further isolate America. Country plunges into the blackest gloom. Tariff acts hurt trade, raise prices. President Alfred McAllister signed the Tariff Act last week, raising custom duties by an average of 60%. Yeah. Shopkeepers and traders said the tariffs will surely cause business to close and prices to skyrocket. Imported woolen products now face a 90% rate. The president asserted at the, at the signing that tariffs result in the national prosperity. Hmm. World's grandest circus, the lights young and old. Oh, by all accounts, Margaret, mistress of danger, brings the grandest circus show. All the surrounding country comes to enjoy the spectacle and splendor that causes wonder and joy. Margaret, mistress of danger, the world's greatest female animal trainer, is the most superior form of canvas-covered entertainment. Hailing from England, Margaret delights the crowd as she wrangles exotic beasts, including zebras, fierce tigers, and ferocious lions. Not anymore. While other traveling circuses have taken to exhibiting the latest fashion in freaks, Margaret delights with feats of animal entertainment. Having held multiple shows in the area, they are packing up tents and heading to roads. Art of angling. Uh, is this more about fishing? I think that's more about fishing. All right, Isaac, hello. Unsound, hello and welcome. We do like our witchy things here. I do practice some w Wiccan beliefs, but I don't necessarily consider myself a full Wiccan. But welcome. All right, everyone. Well, 
We're all caught up. I feel like I know what's going on now again. Um, I'm... I'm thinking this might be a good place for us to call it today. As much as I do want to keep going, it is kind of late here, and I feel like this is a good place to stop because I think we're about to start a whole thing with Dutch and the greys here. So... I'm sure you get better things to do than hang ready around an old cripple like me. For this? For tomorrow? Death the other day. Is there anything else I should do real fast? I'm trying to think if there was anything that I forgot to do. Um ain't like it's the first time. I, I think I think this is maybe where we call it for tonight. So if we take a look. Yeah, we just got Dutch's thing and then we got the Greys. So this is the whole Weapons Forbidden area. We made it down to St. Denis. I'm excited to see more of that at a later date. And... I don't know. We could go run back to camp real fast. Should I maybe go run back to camp? The Dutch mission is very short. So I maybe not stop. Hmm. Yes, this is my very first playthrough. Welcome, Red. You need to get back into this game. It's so good. I've really been enjoying it so far. We're on chapter three. We started chapter three today, and uh, we're just kind of taking our time with it. Um, mm, I'm going to bring us back to camp real fast, and that's where we're going to stop. Just real fast. Let's run, and then we'll come back to Dutch. We'll come back soon. I know it won't take too long. Um, I might skip Strauss's mission. I'm sure it is interesting, though, because that's the problem. It's like, I don't really want to do it, because, like, it's the it's the shaking people down um, who have just taken out loans. I don't love it, but also we might learn more about Arthur Morgan, but I would assume that we just would like how he doesn't, we, we would know more about how he doesn't like to do that, because we've already kind of learned that. Buddy? Buddy. Yeah. Let's go. And we can bring the pelts back to our camp. Okay, so while we're wrapping up here, so we're going we're going back to camp. Oopsies. Whoa, back. Going back to camp. So tomorrow, I'm streaming the next two days again. I'm kind of back. I I didn't even really announce it, but I'm kind of back to like officially full full time streaming again. I've, I've been streaming five days a week, and and doing some extra things just outside of those five five streams per week. So I've been I've been trying to give you guys as much content as I'm as I'm physically able to do. So I hope it's uh, I hope it's been good, and I hope you guys have been liking for hey, been liking it. Hey. Kieran has left All a reward for you at your tent. Oh, that's nice. So, but... Thought you heard something? Uh, that's probably nothing. What? Okay. Well, stay alert. Any sound of trouble, you shoot first. Oh, you heard something? What did you hear? Everything good? Okay, I'll catch you later then. Guess everything's right. good. What are you doing? Wait, no, 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 no. Going fishing. No. The river's right no. here. Famous no. for small no. bass. Fell I didn't. That showed me a couple spots. I just... You want to join me? I just wanted to say ah, hi. I can't fish for you. You're far too good. Oh, dang oh, come it. on, come on. Hey, join me. I'll show you a couple of my tricks. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> There's a spot. Okay, wait. No, that's not. I didn't want to start. I didn't want to start it. I wanted to stop. <laughs> no. Oh my gosh. Um, how far am I? We just started chapter three tonight, and we we played about four hours of chapter three. So we're we're making our way through. Gosh, dang it. All right. What a, well, I've been wanting to try out. All right, Glad one last thing. So excited about this. You will be too when you start pulling out smallmouth. <laughs> no. <sighs> Come on. The fish should be hungry. I guess we're dinner. going fishing. And I guess we're just taking this alligator pelt with us. Wasn't far. Too far to walk. No. Yeah. Come on. Okay. <laughs> Dang it. The game does not want me to leave. Alright, I guess we're not leaving yet. I guess we're, we're vibing and, and catching some fish. Just three more hours, guys. Yeah, don't worry. We'll just be here all night. It's fine. I look over, it's all of a sudden 6 a.m. I'm like, what? Out, just you and me. Probably since we went looking for John on the mountain. 
Already seems long ago. How you feeling about everything? Been a strange couple of months. Hey, you know, I can't even return to my country because the price on my head is so big. This, this is nothing exactly new to me. And I'll always be loyal to Yeah, Dutch. we're just living on the run. He sees the world the same as I do. If we have to fight, we fight. If we have to run, we'll run. If we must die, we'll die, but we'll stay free. And Dutch, you, Fair enough. You don't feel like, well, that he's doing things a little differently now? You saw what happened with that girl on the ferry. No fight, good or bad, is one without blood. I know that He's better defending than most. him. Interesting. I think too many people are focusing on Dutch when they should be looking at themselves. Well, he's your leader, what though. They could have done better. Uh, maybe you're right. I guess. We'll cut through to the right here. We live here now. Yeah, in game. This is my life now. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna make some food from the game tomorrow. I down to the Lanahatchee River. I caught some. Beautiful steelhead trout. You mean the Lanahatchee River? No, 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 no. The, the Lanahatchee. It runs right near here. Yeah, but it's pronounced Lanahatchee. Why is everything in English <laughs> said differently than it's written? Make us feel stupid? <laughs> oh, True. you're asking the wrong feather. True. Okay, it's just down the hill here. Looks like a nice little fishing spot. Dialogue between characters is really impressive. It really is. There's a lot of dialogue, and it seems like a lot of it's missable. I'm gonna make sure I'm going back to camp often. Hey, why are you getting off? Oh, what? Okay, come on. What? Let's go try our luck. <laughs> why am I getting off? I wonder. I wonder why. Pretty country. <sighs> Beautiful. Come on. Let's go see what's biting. All right, well, let's relax at the end of stream here. Let's some fishing. I am assuming that there's different kinds of fish that can be caught in different places. You take this spot, Arthur. I'm going to cast from over to the right there, so we're not in each other's way. Sounds good. Oh, well, there goes my beer. Cheers. And the bait wheel, we don't have any bait. Let's see, medium and large size lake fish. What, what bait should I be using? I don't know what I should be using. Let's try that. Found in the north. Well, redfin pickerel live in the south. I don't know, let's try this. Slowly start reeling. Time of day really can make a difference. What are it's what is everyone's favorite games to fish in? Or late evening, because that's when the insects are more likely to be out. Wonder if this bait's gonna work. Might not. Really slowly reeling. We've got such nice weather. But rain can be good. Like I said earlier, Sometimes I really like starting fish fishing. The raindrops are insects. Something happening? Well, I guess it's still relaxing, even if I don't catch. I guess we're not supposed thing. to catch anything. Sort of like staring at the sky. <laughs> it's your bait, I think. Must Come be. use some of mine. Oh, it's not the bait. Oh. It's me. I've always been a poor fisherman. We've been doing pretty good. Especially compared with you and Jose. I mean, fair enough. Just try some of my here. What you got? Crickets. Crickets? Thanks. Okay. Um, let's let's reset. Crickets. Cricket bait. Crickets are great for catching larger fish, especially smallmouth bass that mostly live in rivers, but can also be found in some larger bodies of water. He's a fighter. Trick is, let him tire himself out. 
All right, let's that. see if we can get a fish. That's a good looking fish. Well done. I can't even see him. I was thinking, you remember that stagecoach we We're held in up some in shadows. Nevada? Yeah, it was a tip from that crooked lawman in Reno. We open the door and it's full of women and children. Rich, but women and children. So we let it go and read in the newspaper that the O'Driscolls robbed and killed them all. Aww. The down the trail. Yep. That's unfortunate. You know, way back in the day, Homo O'Driscoll and Dutch were sort of friends. Friends. Well, not friends, but they had an understanding. Then Combs hmm. Main Street got meaner and Dutch. Dutch wanted to try to live a different way. And now, here we are. Another one. Well, why am I not getting any fish? This guy's getting all the Come fish. On. Maybe if I just keep reeling. Look at that. That's a good looking Let's fish. reset. Well done. Come on. I heard people talk about huge smallmouth in Lake Oangela. Maybe. West of Strawberry over Nick in Big Run, hello and welcome. You don't like the fishing? I mean, fair enough. Animal Crossing fishing also is good. Told you it wasn't that hard. Here we go. He's a fighter. Come on, quick. Go. He's small, but might make a nice meal. What'd we get? Smallmouth bass? Sure, I'll keep it. I'm keeping you. It's getting close to nightfall. Yes, it is. Soon. Let's catch a couple more and then head back. All right. My bag is getting full. Well, we haven't caught much. But there's always another time. Did I need to change the bait? No, I think I'm good now. Reeling it a little bit. Oh, there we go. Oh, nope. That wasn't a strong enough fight. Dang it. Another one. Dang it. This is an angry one. Might need to reset my cast. We'll see. Look at that. That's a good looking fish. Well done. Yeah, I need to reset it. Let's see. Can we get a fish this time? Javier is showing off. Nothing? Another one. Gosh, he's just showing off. We're getting nothing. Oh, we got, there we go. There we go, while it's tired. We're reeling, reeling real fast. Oh, we stop. And we go. Fast! Faster! Another one. Faster! Come on. We're almost there. Good there we go. Time for a stick of dynamite. That would be effective. All right, that should be good. Not bad, you see? It's the bait. <laughs> yes, it, it is. Well, bait. kind I'm of. Head back. <laughs> you want to join me, or uh, you keep trying for these bastards? Mm, let's go back. I'll come. Okay, let's go. Just want to make sure that uh, that alligator pelt doesn't fall off the back of my horse. been a nice evening that was kind of a nice way to wind down at the end of stream i like this so we can go like look in the journal we can read the newspapers we can go fishing at the end of stream and kind of wind down a little bit i like that i'm coming back to camp all righty oh, keep going a little more Hitching post is much further up this time. There we go. Beautiful horse. 
beautiful broomstick. Um, let's remove that alligator skin and see if I can give that to camp or something. Give that to Pearson, maybe. And let's see if he can take it. And where's Sadie? I hope we can go back out with Sadie soon. We'll have to see. You okay with this spot for now, Mr. Hey, Sean. Ah, oh, sure. I like to keep moving, I do. It's in me blood. Along with a lot of whiskey. Very into my crafting at the moment, Mr. Morgan. I'm very happy to make you something if you bring me the right materials. After you. So, I need to bring him stuff. So, he needs certain materials, right? Um, I'm assuming I have to just give it to him first. Main campfire. Do any of these even need an alligator skin? I'm not even sure I've seen alligator skin on these. Back when they called me nephew, I guess. <laughs> not on. Camp tables, pronghorn, boar pelt. It looks like we need a bunch of boar pelts. Okay, there we go. Perfect alligator skin. That's it. That's going to be it. For Arthur's Lodge. And, um, let's donate. Could really use some good meat for this stew. Donate for crafting. with young men. Anyway, want some more meat? Good. We keep we getting really too much of that. This. Yes. Um, and now, let's go back to crafting oh, upgrades. Morgan. Arthur's lodging. Alligator skull. Sure, let's get an alligator skull. That sounds great. Alligator skins add a nice aesthetic to the camp and are good money to sell. Cool. How did you rate it in here? Nice background lurk while you played Dodo. It's great to have you, Drog. Thanks for joining us. <laughs> a very nice addition, I think. Nice. Recipe. Okay, cool. All right, well, that's a good start. I've got some hunting to do. All right, everyone. This is where we're actually going to call it tonight. I'm going to make sure I don't talk to anyone else so we don't accidentally start any more quests here. <laughs> and uh, let's see. Story. That was it, right? Save. Let's save. What percentage are we at now? 36%. Making our way. A lot you can learn by observing camp conversations. I can't wait to see more, you know? I really can't. Um, maybe I'll do a little bit of hunting off stream, but I kind of doubt it. We'll see. Well, you guys, just thank you so much just for, you know, just for everything, for the progress on the new PC is really amazing. And any progress on the daily sub goal just really helps. It goes directly towards um, just helping me create more content and being here as much as I possibly can. So just thank you all so much for being here and all of the love lately. Thank you guys so much for being an amazing part of our, of our witchy coven and a witchy layer here. It is fantastic to have you all. Um, and I hope you guys have a fantastic evening. I will see you all again soon. I am Paige the Witch. I am here on Twitch. See you tomorrow for a cooking stream and the day after for more Red Dead. Have a good one. Good night.